What's up, man? Uh, we're down one webcam today, but uh, I'm trying out a new way to view Melee in the venue. We got a TV to the side because um, when it comes Big Cheese time, I'm probably going to run a TV out to the balcony so you can like watch the stream from out on the balcony if you have to have a smoke and have a drink and that kind of thing. So I'm testing out the TV now, uh, and yeah, hopefully it'll be good. Okay, uh, what, whoa, 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 that was pretty loud. <laughs> What's up? It's Kaiser. It's your boy. It's your boy. Um, so yeah, we're going to be getting Tawny started pretty soon. Um, shout out if you're in chat right now. Um, so, I actually want these to go down a bit. Okay. So I want more bass on the on the old microphones. Testing, testing. All right, that's pretty good actually. I like that. I like the sound. Um, so yeah, we're going to be getting the tournament started pretty soon. Um, a few people are rocking up a bit later, so we're kind of delaying on the tournament a bit. So we're going to get started in like 15 minutes. So stay tuned. Um, I'm just going to be dipping out. should be good. Alright. Alright, I'm going to be dipping out and playing some games in the meantime. So, stick around. We're going to get the Melee tournament started soon. But until then, peace. Um, I'll post the stream out when we're like live with matches. So, yeah. Follow me on Twitter, at KBKaiser, um, for when the tournaments, uh, tournament matches are starting. Alright. Uh, actually, you know what? While I'm here... I'm gonna update the overlay real quick because it is a bit off. So you get to watch me just uh, fumble around a bit here in Photoshop, but you won't see Photoshop. Um, the stream might lose some frames though. So you win some, you lose some. Um, I want design and stream. I want big cheese. Big Cheese Major, 2 cam, and 4-3 out. Okay, so these we've got... Yep. Okay.
There we go, that's what I wanted. Okay, so now I have to find one more file. <laughs> that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. This is the one. Fill. Strike. There we go, we did it, we updated the stream. So it now says, it actually says, um. Hey, what's up? Is, is that a cheat box, buddy? Oh, I love it. Oh, beauty. Very, very nice. Are these say Mitsu or Sanwa? Okay, I like it. You're lucky. I do have a spare one today, but it has the spring. It's um, it's got a, uh, it's got no spring in the right trigger though. In the right trigger. <laughs> you actually upset about it? Do you? I wrote that for right, right trigger too. That's why I took it out. But it's better without it, dude. It, it's it's less strain. It's much better. You can wave dash way better. Okay. Um, I will get it for you in a sec. You know who to call. You know who to call. It's me. <laughs> Is that? Hang on. All right. Yes. How's that? Lemons? <laughs> Below, he's using my controller. Caleb's still good. Caleb's like mostly good.
Okay.
Alright, what's up? What's up, what's up, what's up? It's Kaiser hopping on the mic. Uh, we are actually going to get this show on the road. And up first we got... Lemons versus Marky Mark. Black Shadow. So yeah, it's Kaiser. How y'all doing? Uh, yes, yes. Alright. Where's my phone? There's my phone. Okay. Okay, we're just gonna set everything up here while we wait for the match to begin. Oh yeah, good cameras today. So that's pretty good. Alright. You guys are good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's time for melee! And already, we're starting on B field. I'm excited. And I also probably need to update the, uh, the screen. Okay, I'm back. What's up? I'm gonna tweet the stream out and stuff, so I might not be commentating for a little bit. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Alright, BRB.
Alright, sorry about the no commentary everyone. I've been just trying to work on some admin stuff in the meantime in between the match. Um, but yeah, congratulations to Mark for taking that out, 2-0. Good stuff. Alright, so are you going to sue now that you lost with that controller? Oh my God. Are you going to sue now that you lost Maybe. with that controller? Did you see game one? I mean, no, I didn't see any. I didn't game see any of the match. As close as that game, except he didn't SD. So it's pretty, you know, it's pretty good. I haven't been watching any of the matches because I've just been on my phone the whole time Both games working out cool. everything. Why isn't this posting to Melee streams right now? My Facebook app is just, like, given up on life. It's definitely not... It's definitely a controller that would take some getting used to. Yeah, um, look, I'm not going to say... I'm not going to front and say it's, like, the best one. What's up, Nick? He didn't show up today. I mean, fair enough. We didn't get Musket or Ruben in the bracket. I don't even know if they're here yet. I don't think... Th I know that... S I can see Scraddles. I don't know if he's in the bracket. But I know Jack's on the setup right now. What is the bracket looking like? I don't know. For our folks at home. For our folks at home. No, that's all good, Nick. You, you cool. You cool. We cool. We always cool, Nick. We always cool. What did you say? I'm just saying to Nick that we cool. Ah. Uh. We cool. Right. Yeah, bro. How you been? Uh, you know. How 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 was? All it? right. All right. All right. All right. That one's for you, Nick. Finally got my cheat box in order. You know, ready to play some the cheat third box? strike or whatever. I don't know. It seems perfectly legal to me. The only the, the one thing I think is kind of like but yours seem. Oh wait, what? Because my um my like qualification or well, disqualification for controllers are when you can do uh two movement inputs with uh opposite hand with like different hands at the same time that's my that's my only you mean um, like you mean like left and left with the same with different hands you yeah know yeah mean? all my buttons on my stick each one of them is mapped to one specific thing yeah see that's fine right but have did you did you see the hitbox cross up i did that shit's fucking cheating I that's actually know. fucking cheating it seems pretty good no it's fucking bullshit man they're <laughs> they're like that hitbox I, I don't trust hitbox i actually don't trust hitbox anymore like dead set i'm 
fuck. Maybe, maybe, maybe they're trying to scare people into being like, well, okay, the hitbox is not that bad. Look at this monstrosity. Let's ban that instead. <laughs> <laughs> See, because no, the normal hitbox is fine. And um, when they came out with the Smashbox and they took forever to like get it out and stuff, like that shit's bullshit to me. And they're just a business looking to scam some money out of people who ju just will do anything for the next like, you know, control attack thing. You know, mm. I think they're just a scummy group. Well, I've heard that's my opinion. That the cross up is technically the same inputs. Or works similarly to a dual struck four controller. I know that, but you but you can't you cannot you can't press the D pad and the analog stick with two hands and also have access to all your fighting buttons. True. It's that's less convenient. That's the thing. It's like you can do it, but it's not like you can't you can't. I actually think of the the well I, I, I have had some pro pros do use both the D-pad and the stick. I don't know what they do with it. Yeah, no, I know that you can do probably that. Probably like though. Sonic Grooms, like, maybe. Like, I, know. Um, I know pad players, they do like all their motions on the stick and then like dashing with D-pad. Oh. And um, uh, <coughs> yeah, like that kind of thing. That's I've, I've uh, seen Smug talk about it a bit. Um, right. He's a famous pad player. Mm. Um, you know, storied, successful. Smug was so good in Ultra Street Fighter 4. Fucking... Yeah, he's pretty good at that game. <sighs> Dude, that, that game was so Duffed. good. <laughs> <laughs> he, uh. I think I th probably the, m the more interesting thing... I watched a video today talking about... Uh, it was like kind of old, but it was a really like, informative video talking about like how hitboxes work and like... It was specifically about like Daigo's hitbox and why it was banned, like what was different oh, about it. Oh, the Gaffro it. box. Yeah, what was different about it. Yeah, and it yeah. ended with saying that the DualShock 4 like works the same way that Gaff that Daigo's banned hitbox works. Like it has the same SODC inputs and also you can do Yeah, cuz like you know, you know a regular hitbox when you hit press left and right at the same time, it gets neutral. Yeah. On the apparently on the DualShock 4, it's last last of it wins is which what uh, Daigo's was. So if you're holding right with the D-pad and then you press left or the other way around, it gives you whatever you press. Yeah, yeah. So, so here's, here's my, like, thing. with. It's so if you have a hitbox, right? If you have a hitbox, you should be allowed to do, like, you should be allowed to have a second set of buttons for your left hand. I think that should be okay. You mean, like, punches and stuff? No, 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 uh, for movement. What's up next? You got Will D. Okay. Lemons, you have um, Fenno. Who? Fenno. I don't know who that is. I'm the guy in the beret. Me. Oh, the not the fucking. Wait, not oh, that high. guy. I yeah, love that Fenno. guy. Fenno's cool. I just don't know his name. Yeah, there you go. Fenno. Now I know who it is. Mark on stream, I guess. Huh? Me, Mark on stream. Right. Unless you want to play Will on stream. She I'll tell you what it is. It does seem kind of. We got You know what's kind of weird to me? Because I didn't realize until until this very recently. Is that because the left and right gives you neutral, but up and down give you up. On hitbox. That's fucked. Yeah, I don't know why that's the case, but apparently that's the standard. And so you can do. I tested this out in Unist, and you can flash kick with like pressing up and like the punch with the well, what a button it is with both hands. So you can hold crouch and then just hit up and like the button with both hands. You get flash kick. Mm. The thing that, that made me really go. Good. The thing that made me go absolutely. Uh, well, it's not a beret. It's like a. a it's non, a hat. It's a non all hat. You know, if you if you got a non all in your life, you know it. It's like the it's like the flat golf cap thing. Yeah, like it's got like a brim, but it comes. He's an FGC enthusiast. It's like a Baker boy. It's a Baker boy. Anyway, yeah. um, yeah, I don't know. I th I, th I legitimately thought until like a week or two ago that up and down would just be neutral because I thought oh, yeah. it makes sense, but apparently that's not the case. Um, so that's so how my hitbox works. So on. my my opinion is like the cross ups fucked, super cheat. Um, but I've, I've also heard that apparently the hitbox right. is more optimal than the cross up, right? Some some opinions, though it's less outwardly cheating. Or outwardly, like what the hell is no, this? No, the normal hitbox is legal. Yeah, I know it's legal, but it's like I've I've heard people say way, that like it's not cheat. The optimal. No, I, it I is. think I think hitbox is optimal, but it's not cheat. Yeah. Anyway, it's legal, and that's what matters to me. And I like using it, or I I like using keyboards, so I'm gonna gonna try and use it. Yeah, anyway, I gotta play somebody. I think. Uh, see you later, crowd.
Howdy, howdy, howdy. Oh, uh, we got some exciting Peach Falco gameplay coming up yep. for you boys. Uh, do we have to put anything in? I think we do. Uh, can you guys hear me? That's good. Oh, that's good. That is well. Anything I'm missing? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Alright. Uh, how do I switch the... Do you know how to switch the... modes? Alright, good pistols. We'll figure out eventually. There we go, this one. I wouldn't know how to switch this. Uh, do we have... Let's like this. Back on. Right. I am bamboozled. Alright, whatever. You get to see our faces until yeah. we figure out how to swap it. Alright, Kaya's taken a pretty decent lead. Game one. Yeah. One to Dreamland. Oh, good down smash. Excellent down smash as well, Woody. Oh, that's... It's spooky, covering. Yeah, yep. it is. Uh -huh. Kai's really, really good at covering um, a lot of different up angles, actually. Yeah. Oh, that, that was not the up tilt you wanted to do. Kai's um, got a few more peaches to run through tonight, so... Yeah. He's going to have to clean up. Not <laughs> he's got us, too. A little too. bit. Uh, oh. I can't believe that down smash worked and Peach didn't get hit. Or maybe she didn't. She like CC'd or something. Oh, that looks very weird to me. Woody keeping this one very close. Yeah. It's two down smashes away from a game two. I'm surprised. Um. Uh, he doesn't get the mistake punish. Yeah, go ahead, guys. I'm just surprised that Will chose the stage. Well, you have what? So you ban. So you have to, you get to choose this or Battlefield, right? I mean, Kai probably banned FOD, I assume. Yeah, yeah, I assume you banned FOD FD. So you choose this Battlefield or Yoshi's? Oh, uh, what about FD? Kai bans, like, FD and oh. Battlefield. Uh, FD and... Wait, is this game... Did you this say game this? game 1, isn't it? Is it? I thought you said it's game 2. I believe this is game 1. Because we just sat down. They were warming up when we sat down. Ah, uh, okay. Well... But yeah, well... I, I personally prefer Battlefield, Battlefield over this. But that's just me. Yeah, that's fair. Um, I definitely prefer Battlefield versus Fox, mm. but because Ooh. like it's like see how Will lives to 175 yeah. here, so like Falco can't kill you most of the time. Yeah. And like even though neutral's better. Oh, sorry. Yeah. How do I do that? Oh, thank oh. you. There we go. Sorry, guy. <laughs> sorry, guy. That's what. That's why he's not doing as good. Alright, uh, now Kai can be 100% focused uh -huh. on the gameplay. Now that we have yeah. the correct scenes. Yeah. Unfortunately, 100% focus was not enough to not run into Woody's down smash. Yep. Will. I, mean, I just love how his name's Woody. Yeah. And he down smashes a lot. I mean, if the down smash is hit, then. <laughs> well, I guess. I suppose. Oh, he's trying really hard not to get Will. down smashed. Will's actually. Ooh. That was a really smart. Um, Wait and then down smash on the shield. I I liked what he was. Oh going my god, for. can he cover it? No, oh. that's all right. I think what you, you pretty much always want to turn with your back facing to the Falco, like if you have that much time. Yeah, it's just it's just hard because he's probably lasering you, putting on pressure. It's yeah, but I mean like when the Falco um when you hit the Falco off stage. Oh, that's what you meant. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh, is this? Can he cover it? Oh that was... no, no. Oh, okay, but okay, Kai doesn't cover the ledge. Oh, oh, roll oh. in. Panic he's, roll in. He's living. Oh no, this is not the spot. Oh no! Oh, There's spaghetti! No. Spaghetti going everywhere. <laughs> oh no. That back here. He's oh. living. See Dreamland? Yeah. That's why I I, I don't like a vs Fox, because Fox oh. just up smashes oh, you. Oh, he waited. <gasps> oh! Oh, that was no! Like, no! No! <laughs> no, Will! No! Oh. Uh. Yeah, no. Oh, okay. He's just getting his oh, water. Yeah. I thought he was coming to lecture us. <laughs> Take us uh, off commentary. Good job, Kai. <laughs> A good job. Slight, <laughs> slight bias for one of the players on this commentary, I'm going to have to say. <laughs> quick Combination says to tell Will to stop being a noob. Who is Quick Combination, do you think? I, I don't... Alright, it's very loud. 
I oh, know, right? Hey, Kai's pretty pro, and Wildy landed a lot of down smashes. I disagree with this pick, but... Oh, actually, no, I don't, actually, because he lived to 175 every single start. I guess. Like... Oh, of course it is. Yeah. It's just like on Battlefield, you can, um... You can sort of chain grab spacings. Sort of. No, like, I know no. I know it's not the actual chain grab, but you can... But the problem with Battlefield, well, battle, both Battlefield and um, Dreamland have this problem where the platforms are too high, so if you up throw and the lands on the platforms, like, the, like they, you don't have enough time. Unless they're really high percent, you don't have enough cut time to, like, do anything if they're on the platforms. Like, you just lose your money. Well, like, on Dreamland, you can't really do it, but on Battlefield, the platforms are low enough that you can sort yeah. of... Like, I've definitely done it before, but... Yeah, it's about, like, only a high percent. Yeah. I think Fountain, but, like, the, I think... B looking at how last game went, and how, like, Will... Like, eventually... So, but I think Will's logic is eventually Kai will run into down smashes. We just need to make sure yeah. we survive as long as possible <laughs> to yeah. get as many opportunities for that to happen. Yeah. Now, Kai should be banning uh, Dreamland next time. I, I agree, too. Uh, he ban I don't... I actually don't agree with FD ban. Oh, uh, but... Wildy actually has the chain grabs now, so I don't know. Does he? I believe so. I thought he had it against um, Falcon. It, Falcon is harder though, to be fair. No, Falcon is easier. Really? I find it easier, but... Okay. But I use Daisy, so, you know, it's just... Wildy so just getting lasered. <laughs> you use Daisy, so you found... <laughs> Choke D? Oh, oh, that's me. Well, yeah, I... I I agree to strike Dreamland. Like, I don't like going to Dreamland against good Falcos because they know well, how to actually use space. Falco doesn't actually get the strike right. It's like, um, Falco always bans FOD, FD. So Peach gets to pick between battle, yeah. uh, between Yoshi's Dreamland and yeah. Battlefield. It's just I don't like going to Dreamland against Kai. Yeah. Kai will sit on those platforms. Yeah, as, as will, Spacey should. He will continue sitting on those platforms. Yep. And Back at you. Sometimes he will come down from the platform. Oh, and then he Excellent will double down now. And that will be game to Will uh, to Kaiser. Yep. Two over uh, Congratulations. I think I'm. I believe I have I Will now. You might have Kai. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have Kai. All right, Will, I got you. Let's go. Okay, what's up? It's Kaiser. Oh, is this real? Oh, no way. This is real. This is the match. This is definitely actually the match right now. Hi. Hi. Uh, you want to do that? There we go. They definitely just went into it. Yeah. Alright, I am. We're in there. 
Oh, what? Ruben subscribed on his way here. Ooh. What's up, Ruben? Thank you for subscribing. Ooh. That's pretty agreeable. Nick, Mark does makes too many mistakes with a character that he can't make any mistakes with. Oh, yeah. And she just gonna, like, get a grab off of all, all that. Oh, like, just a crouch cancel? Oh, yeah. Jack froths the crouch cancel into down smash. It's Peach, honestly. Yeah. Oh, he wanted the reverse. We all did. Yeah, this is looking pretty good for, um, Jack. Old, for old Jack right now. Yeah. He's going back, Jack, and do it again. This is, this is first game, right? Yeah, this is the first game. Um, yeah. I don't know where in the bracket this is, so I might just pull that up on my phone really quickly. Um, this is probably the best stage Falcons could get in this matchup. In this matchup, yeah. Mm -hmm. FD, you're going to get chain grabbed or like tech chased. FOD's no good. I Actually, I mean, Dreamland's not too bad, but I think... Yeah, actually, Dreamland's probably better for Falcon like Ma, I'd say. It's really hard to say like which is better on this stage. Oh, I think Sheik might be a bit better on this stage, and maybe Falcon's better on Dreamland because he can actually maneuver around Sheik hitboxes. Mm. So maybe it's like the opposite. But this is still the first yeah. game, so like, oh, all right, Mark is going for guts, going for glory right now. Yeah, you need to do this. All right. Okay. He's actually brought it back. If he doesn't make mistakes. Oh, there's one. Oh no. That that's was one, that's that's one too many. <laughs> Mark about to nearly bring it back. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> that was the hottest call of 2019. Yeah. Alright, so where in the bracket is this? We have a nine person evac tournament. Ooh. That's pretty hype. Um, so this is definitely loses quarters. So this is. I sorry, winners, winners semis. So um, this is best of five, no bands. Dude, that could be in top three potentially. No, you're definitely going to get top three. Wait, what? Don't I have to beat someone? You have to beat me. Ah. Uh, I have to beat. You can beat. You can beat Mark. Yeah. You can beat Mark. It's definitely doable. That's high. That would be high. Yeah. Money. Money. That nine. That nine person money. <laughs> ten percent of. Ten percent of what? That's like five each. Forty-five. So you get you get four dollars and fifty cents. Not even entry back. Jesus, it, this isn't peach time, mate. <laughs> I got 60 for winning that. Oh, Jesus. See, this is why you have to tell... Wait, if you're in the bracket... Yeah. Wait, did you get hit before your brother? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, I was like, wait, what happened to the last cat? Uh, he just... <laughs> I'm like, why isn't he in the bracket, but you are? And then I forgot. I, I was doing stuff, like, actually existing. Crazy, right? Yeah. <laughs> So even though Mark's still got another game to play with, you really want to take this one now. Wait, this is the best of five? Um, it's semi, so we, we run best of five oh. for that. If these guys yeah. get off, if Floey wins this one and they both get off, I'm going to be like, nah, guys, just just stay it. Yeah. Musket is at EVAC, but he got here late. Like, everyone was really late to get here today. Uh, Nick said he might show up, but he didn't. Um, what else happened? Um, Bailey's here, but he's Bailey's here, but not he, entered. He's not entered because he's probably at work. Yeah. Is Scraddles even in the bracket? Uh, I know he's here. The Scrad Daddy in bracket? Ooh. No. <laughs> we have people here, but we just didn't have enough people for a bracket. So Why would you not wait? Because it was 6 o'clock. It was six o'clock, and we started the tournament. Let's just uh, leave it at that. All right, so this is pretty even, which is like people weren't here still at six, so we started essentially. Yeah, yeah Mark's actually brought us back. Yeah, pretty good stage of Falcon since um, there's platforms that he can use, but. Um, there's sort of, I don't want to say a blind spot, but in the middle, Sheik doesn't have the best maneuverability. Yeah, would you say Sheik has to, like, commit a bit harder if she goes middle? Oh, um, that was clean. And also, she has to be really careful, especially with her jumps. Uh, oh my god, okay, Ooh. Mark knows so much more about Falcon than I do. I thought he was 100% dead, but it doesn't matter. He's playing against Florence. I hope he knows 
the Falcon. Considering he mains it. But he's doing he's doing good stuff. He's doing good stuff. Oh. Look at that. That's that some good Falcon. Oh. 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 Okay, might might clean this up, oh. but he flubs it. It was so close. Don't get out of the ledge. Get out of the ledge, Mark. Yeah. He doesn't want to be there. Oh, no. Oh. Jack's actually really good at coming back to stage. Yeah. All right. This should be... He should get this one. Clean this up. That's All it. Right. There you go, Mark. Yeah. He's in this. It's 1-1 one, one now. So what stage do you think Jack's going to go to? Fod. Fod? Yep. What a call. Like, there's, there's no question about it. Yeah. He was going Fod. I guess, yeah. That's the standard against yeah. Falcon. And these are two characters you haven't really played much of. But I remember you were playing Falcon for a while. Did you play against much Sheiks during that time? Uh, no, not really. I don't think we really had many Sheiks at any one point. We've only had, yeah, we've only usually had like one at a time. Yeah, it's like, it's only Jack. He's the only... Oh my god. What a beast. That was actually such a low scooping up oh, air. Really? Oh my god. All right, Mark's got the conver conversions today, actually. Fountain is good for Mark. This is a fact. Yeah, it's a really good fit for him, actually. I'm getting messages from Sadiq in the corner, just saying, come play your third strike when you're done. And I'm like, bro, I'm trying to win this tournament. <laughs> yeah, you just, just drop out of the tournament. Can so I? I'll drop out of the tournament to play third strike. Yeah. And I'll stream that instead. Like, I'm just going to disassemble everything here, just so that we can get third strike instead. Yeah. But that's my plan. I don't know about everyone else. That's a good TO, you know. <laughs> God, I wish Flowey shield dropped. There we all, fam. I don't have heard he's like, oh, like doing good oh. first. Oh. oh, Jack actually low key got some good tech chases. I literally have been spamming shield drop ever since UCF just to like prove the point to everyone here. Just like you just do it, you just yeah. do it. But you know, so good. We, it's it's so good. It's like, so here we are still though. In a in a shield oh. dropless jack. Hey, one day he's gonna have to do it. Like. One of these days, I tell you. Yeah. Not today. I remember, like, I was in friendlies, I was doing shield drop shine. Feels so good. Shield drop shine's pretty bonkers. Yeah. It's pretty hamburgers, as they say. Yeah. Ooh. Mark just wants to like end this stock in as the craziest Mark way possible, I mean, and he does it in the least Mark way possible. <laughs> it was looking cool. When it was looking cool up until Floy just SD. gift wrapped it for him. Yeah. Okay. Um. Are we gonna see a grab into sadness? Or are we gonna see some Mark? Oh, this. Oh. Thorin's actually really good at like knowing when to challenge follow-ups. Mm. I mean, you gotta have that if you're a floaty, if you're a sheik. Is sheik flo floaty? Uh, I would say in that moth. Like semi-floaty. Right? Yeah. She's got good fall speed, that's the thing. Too. Yeah. It's a shame about the short hop height. Yeah. Oh? What do we got? That was an up smash he went for. Oh? <laughs> that's it. Really? 2-1. Mark showing some signs of life as he's warming up in this game. Are we going to see Soldy run back? Mm. I almost think... Damn, I like really just need... Yeah. yeah okay, okay. I think if Florats went to... Um, went to Yoshi's, it would have been a death note for him. For uh, for uh, Florats, sorry. Because he would just get need and that would be that. I mean, I feel like she can do really well on that stage, especially in this I matchup. agree, but I don't think Florats has the platform movement to really give it a good run. Yeah. Oh, it has so much shit done. It has so much shit done. Yeah, you can read a book and drink a cup of tea the time it takes for them to recover. Oh. Damn, Clarence oh. just really fishing with these forward airs with the full hub. You know, he's trying to take the stock. Yeah, he's at 100 now, so like he's starting to get show a little signs of desperation. Uh, when you start doing that... Oh, <gasps> <That's> no. 
That's a mark if I ever saw one. I was gonna, <laughs> I was gonna say, um, when, when you start trying to go for these fairs, or whatever, when they're like 100, it just, it just ends up doing the reverse and you end up losing more. Yeah. I mean, sometimes the raw knee hits, or your raw fair hits. Oh my god, what an angle! Okay, so now Flora Rats are starting to shield drop yeah. a bit. Yeah. Force Gamer, thank you for following. Hey, I like how he was near ledge, just gotta be more careful. Oh. Mark pressures the corner really interestingly. Mm. He doesn't like lock his position down on Ooh. the stage. Instead, he'll just give you the stage, yeah. make you think that you're fine and you don't have to protect yourself, and then he'll just like do it like a Randy short hop like across the stage with a down air. And sometimes it works for him, and sometimes it doesn't. But against like, Flowerats, I think it's actually pretty safe to go for it. Ooh. He hasn't shown that he can really punish him hard for doing it, and he's gonna clean up a stop for it. Yeah. I mean. Jack can, um, take, Jack can, he can win this. This is definitely one of those matchups and stages. Yeah, but Jack's just letting so many Marg's mistakes go, like, unbrutalized, we'll yeah. say. And like, that now is not what you want to be doing. Like, if you get in these shield grabs as Jack, you, you got to make the most of it, and he's not getting as much as Marg is off of his grabs. Flareth's starting to check out of this set, Ed, I think. Yeah. He can take it. He just yeah. needs to really want it. Yeah, this is this is even nice. now. This is not a this is not unwinnable. Definitely a grab ledge moment. Yeah. Mark oh going no. crazy. Oh, Jack just needs to clean it up. He could have shield dropped back there on that platform. Oh yeah. Done things. Okay. okay, okay. So is this the stop? Nah. I mean, he could. He could have. Okay, thank god that oh, killed, because okay. I was about to get wa pretty worried oh. here. Oh. This is still like... Jack can definitely win this stuff. Oh, he's got the grab. It's going to get oh. to the platform. No, he doesn't oh, get no. to the platform. That doesn't combo, by the way, but he's still going to keep oh, it no, going. That. Oh, Ooh. that was so smart. Yeah. Jack about to win this. Oh. Ooh, Ooh. Jack is actually about to win this. Oh, That's oh it. he didn't get the tech. Yo, clutch as hell by Jack. Damn, Mark just looking like what happened. He nearly had it. He actually was in control for yeah. so much of that, and Jack just owned him. <laughs> Clutch rats indeed, yeah. Ruben. Damn. Yeah. I, I didn't think this would go to a game five, Cass. Well, you know, um, that's a good thing, I guess. More of this, I'm sure people want to see. It's been a while since I've seen these two play, now that I think about it. Yeah. And Mark doesn't really play that much, so I'm sure not many people are sad to see this go to Game 5. Yeah, Mark's a bit of a nomad of melee in Adelaide. Mm. Yeah. You have to make the oh most no. of his appearances. <laughs> oh no, he didn't have a jump. He actually died to one pack air. <laughs> that just really... It just happened. That just really happened. Also, FD, yeah, honestly, that makes sense. This is... Ah... I know, it, it well, makes sense. For Falcon, I almost want to say you might have wanted. Uh, I don't know, it's hard to. I think this probably is the best pick at this point in the set. Because Stadium, you actually give Sheik a bit more options. Oh! That was a sh such a big call out, because Florence actually loves dashing off the stage and coming back with the back air. Yeah, all oh, fair. Ooh. Was that a nipple spike though, or was that just. No, nah, it was just down. It was just the regular down air. Uh. It was just because Jack probably jumped at the same time. Ah, okay. That he couldn't either meteor cancel or have a double jump to get back. No tech from Mark. Oh. He usually hits those. Oh, uh, that's, that's not good. He needs to... He needs to not get grabbed. Okay. Farad's not really that clean on the reactions there. I think that, like... Some slight spaghetti, which is like, it's game five, so fair enough. But yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. I, that actually really reached. I'm... I was very skeptical about that side B. Ooh. Oh no. Mark probably thinks that he can do him just because Jack isn't punishing him too hard. Yeah, but like, you really can't side B loosely against Sheik. Whoa. Jack got caught yeah. jumping out of shield with an aerial and he got clipped with that knee. Mark's not going to clean it up, but he really needs oh. to at this point. Oh! oh. What no. a great adjustment. Is that, is that true? Uh, he actually, Flareth's jumped into it. Oh. Okay. Yeah. He double jumped into it, but um, Mark, like, adjusted where he put his knee so it would hit. Yeah, he waited. 
Another good planet. Uh, okay, I was expecting a bit more there. Like an actual good tech chase, but... Do you think Mark is the one to tech chase? I mean, he... He kind of mixes it in, yeah. but he's, he doesn't always go for it. He's done some to set. Yeah. I just think that if you're on FD, you have to be going for it, and you have to be hitting it. Yeah. And, like, Mark's had some really fortunate things go Ooh. his way, but oh. it can all be over with just one more back throw mm. here. I'm surprised Jack didn't back throw there. Like, I would have tried. Oh. He's got an opportunity oh. here. He's just going to knee him just for the position, but he really wanted to finish. Oh, oh that's actually going to keep it going. Mark trying to swag on him. All right, now if he could... Um, oh, he's giving up so much stage, oh. though. Oh, that's oh, what no. he wants. No. No, oh, oh! Tech, it's attack finally. No. But the call-outs, that's it. Oh. That's all she wrote. Oh. I think we're up next. So. Yeah. All right, we up there. GX gets, that's what gets those texts. All right, so it's uh, Catherine and I on stream. Shout out to my next, my second game today, Kaiser vs. Catherine. My second melee plugin of today. All right. All right, stream. Wish us both luck. We out here. We got a we got a match for you, ladies and gents. Can you hear me? Hello. Maybe this one's better. Okay. Let me swap headphones. I'm more confident that this one works. They probably both work. All right. We got Kai versus Catherine here. He's already put in all the details for me. How nice. Him. Kai definitely the favorite. You know, one of our higher ranked players. Catherine, you know, young up and coming. Young up and comer. Kinda. Somewhat. She, she's starting to. She's been around for a couple of years, but, you know, I think more recently she's maybe starting to get a little bit more close to, you know, she's broken onto the PR. So, you know, she's making, making strides. There we go. Go with a hammer to start. Mm, da, 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 da. Play ship bets. Firstly, I, w I think most people would give Kai the edge in this set. And I gotta play, apparently, unfortunately. But, you know, I'll leave you with this. Apparently, Kai almost lost, or had a very close game with Wildy. Wildy choked it away. And now he's gonna face another young Peach. Will he do it? Will he, will he, will he almost lose again? Or will he take the whole loss this time? Or will, who knows what will happen? You'll have to find out right now. Right now. You're gonna find out right now. Get get hype. Bye.
Alright, game three. I'm back. And Kai is definitely in the winning position, but it's a real chance for an upset. Oh, tip of the boot. Catches you. That's That would have been a heartbreaking way to lose. So luckily she's got another chance. Oh, Kai is starting to... trying to get his rhythm back, but... How did my match go? I won 2-0 against Caleb, and Catherine's looking like she might have a chance to make a similar upset. Roll in, no punish. Oh, she's greedy, tries to go for another one, but... Yeah. Kai just managing. And just stay composed. And he's taking it 2-1, unless this, unless this is a best of five. This is winning semis. This might be a best of five, holy shit. Damn. Let's go. Best of five? I thought he's got more chances. I thought this was only a best of three. Adjust my culture. I just, you know, all right. Best of five. Catherine's down one set. You know, Kai's definitely had more experience in these best of five sets, but, you know, he's probably feeling a bit more pressure than Catherine is. Because he's he's expected to perform. He's he's uh, established a certain level for himself. And Catherine, yeah, she's up and coming, but she's currently not quite at that level to be Kai. Or maybe she is. Huge <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. It's how I could afford that new hitbox. <coughs> All right, Catherine. You know, spending some time thinking about it. Where she wants to go. She's going to Battlefield. Respectable choice. Bang it all on Battlefield Fair Stage. I mean, DJ Nintendo was probably doing that because he's one of the few Bowser players out there, so he's trying to keep all the knowledge to himself and mislead you. Oh my god. Kai in the corner. Trying to fight his way out, he's made it. Ooh. That was really cool. Just dipping down with the shine, because even if, it, if she shielded it, Peach is going to have a hard time punishing it, but right now, she's putting the punish to Falker. Definitely planned. Oh! The Z drop? What frame does that come out? It's got to be fast. Oh, man. Nice combo, nice, nice, simple punish by Kai. Down, down air, to s down smash. Confirmed. Ooh. Caught her sleeping there. She's, she th probably thought she was safe, a bit out of his range, but actually, oh, mental pressure. As I said, the Kai is probably under more pressure than Catherine is, Esper and that compounds with the fact that Falco, he kind of suffers a bit more from me from uh, panic and anxiety and stress on the part of the player than Peach does. She's tend to be a bit more of a stable character. There's a few more, you know, reliable panic options. Oh, that's tragic. That's a huge trade for Catherine. She gets, she's even still living after that. Wow, how does Kai just... Not, not even challenging. Okay, she should be dead there. All right. At least Kai's got a one game buffer to work with, but probably looking to put this away now and 
to keep things from getting too out of hand. Cool. He's looking like he's starting to get 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 his groove on again. How's Catherine gonna take care of this? Fighting on the edge for a bit. Ooh, Kai kind of dropping the somewhere, but he's still got the upper hand, upper hand. Yeah, remaining calm is a huge, hugely important factor in games like these and in melee in general. You just gotta have the inner confidence to not stress. At least not too hard. Roll in, punishes it. Yeah. All right, it's down to this. This could be Catherine's last dog. Let's see what she's got. Kai trying to play the top platform, wait out the invincibility. Pretty smart move. Fakko's superior mobility, gets him opening. Playing, trying to play pretty safe. Just basically just doesn't want to get down smashed and hold it together. Catherine trying to find an opening. Oh, that's pretty big. Get attack. Kind of risky. Some more hits. Oh, that was so scary. I couldn't have a down smash. Man. Oh, that trade. Kai was a bit high percent. That could have been death for him. That anxiety is going to start to build up. Gotta keep calm. Oh. Big momentum for Catherine. Kai trying to find his footing. Oh, he got hit by that? Oh my god. So close. That's gonna hurt the double. He's still in it though. Oh, this thing get up in it. Get punished, but he's still got more chances. Okay, she's up pretty high. Kai kind of going for something, but laser forward smash. That's gonna hurt. The old simple. That laser forward smash was, was pretty smart though, because you know it was pretty low risk. Because if she had shielded it, it probably would have pushed her off the ledge, and he would have been fine. So it's a pretty smart move actually. Although laser forward smash is a typical like new player thing, and that particular one was uh, was smart. Well done. He kept his composure. Mark right. next. Three one. We've got Mark and McLeod up next. That's a spicy match. Click gonna win, you know. Could happen. I that is, that is the beauty of the next the next set is you, I don't think anyone. You might have a feeling, but I think it's a really close. It really it really really could go either way. Like Kai, although Catherine certainly had some chances there. It's still certainly going into it. You would probably think Kai's probably gonna win. Maybe like. 80 plus percent of the time maybe 90 plus percent of the time even though it did look kind of scary there at parts you know but McLeod you know he's definitely someone who's put in a lot of work trying to trying to think about the game you know tries to play various different characters you know uh, and trying to really learn some things Mark he's been a long time he's just a pretty he's just a you know he's a smart player and he just has that I don't know. He's just pretty good. You know, it's kind of, again, another, like last set, it's kind of another old guard versus new guard. But I think this one is a lot more close. Sorry? Nobody else is, no. It's just me talking to whoever's in the chat. You know, speculating. Who do you, who do you think is going to win this next game? McLeod versus that guy, Mark. Oh, that guy. Damn. Yeah, that guy. Pretty good, right? Both both pretty good players. Yeah. I think they're pretty close. I think um, Black Shadow's gonna win. Yep. Yeah. 
Nick thinks Crisp and Glow. I don't even know who that is. Uh, Nick thinks uh, McLeod is going to win. I or mean, McFly, uh, you know. Well, like, McLeod's going to use Peach, or at least. Yep. Go with Peach. He was playing Peach versus um, versus Mark earlier in Friendlies today. I yeah. think from what I saw, it was a close game. I think the one yeah. game I saw the ending to was a very close last stock and McLeod won it, but that isn't, you know. Well, I mean, maybe maybe uh, Black Shell do better in tournament. Yeah. I mean, he beat me. He must be pretty good. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm pretty good. Yeah. Damn. I mean, beat me. I mean, I've beaten Caleb. Oh, yeah, that's... I beat Caleb today. Yeah. It was, it wasn't... It was a pretty convincing set. I, I felt like I played pretty pretty well. I kept my calm. So what am I it, typing in? So was it 2-0? Yeah, it was. Ooh. And it was like... The second game was like 3-star. And the first game was like 2 or 3 or something. Ooh. I don't know. Damn. I don't Prime know. It, I, I never felt... Well, I don't know. I guess, I guess part of me was like, I, I just want to get this. I don't know. Whatever. I don't want to talk too much about it. No. Point is, it was a good, clean set for me. Yeah. Uh, Black Shadow, that's just okay. You can hear, right? Yeah, I can hear you. Good. Alright, Cloud is playing the White Peach. Yeah, Wait. that's his ult. Oh, it is Peach White, that's how you talk. Okay. Is there a Daisy a ult? Like, is it registered? Like, when you, go playing the white peach? when you go to the Peach ult, does it just say Peach Daisy or? I'm kind of curious. Uh, I think it does because Kai's uh, strange. Yeah, yeah Peach, yeah. But Kai is misinformed. Oh, thank you, I just needed to know. Why is it not showing up? Questionable. There we go. Okay, so there we go. What? Wait, what? This. Right, okay. All right, yeah, cool. Oh, there we go. I gotta put in McLeod in this one too. Oh, nearly got. Oh, there we go. Well, not nearly got the knee, but try. There we are. Big oh. fly. Ooh. I did. They did what? Oh, Nick's asking who put McLeod in losers. Uh, I don't know. I assume that's what he's asking. I put him in losers. Oh, you did. Yep. Damn. It was a close game one. Like that was. Was he playing Peach? Yeah. You know who else has beaten this Peach before? What? You know who else has beaten this Peach before? You mean his or mine? His Peach before. Oh. Uh, who? You know, I'll leave that up to yeah, guess. <laughs> Bank. I'm sure enough of the pieces of the puzzle are, uh, are there to figure out who. Oh. Anyway. I know. I think he back has more than you, so I guess that makes it better. Boy, it's Peach. Add the Peach to though. Oh, I haven't played the Peach to against him. You, the more uh, you no, I, I, I beat, I beaten his Peach before. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, the tournament said. He wasn't very happy about it. Anyway, why am I talking about this? Probably to brag. Uh, yeah. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Alright, okay, so. That kind of oh. sucks when that happens. Getting hugged like that and then you lose, then you lose the opportunity to edge guard. That's one of those things that feel, you, feel, you feel like it shouldn't happen. It happens again. Yeah. You feel like it shouldn't happen, but then when it does, it's like, oh, yeah. it shouldn't happen. I should, he should be dead. Good to see you. Stupid falcon. Hey, he needs it. You have any idea what it's like as a falcon? I played him before. Yeah, it's He doesn't need anything. It he sucks just uses raw fundamentals and reads. The double. I mean, I just need pressure. Exactly. <laughs> 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 oh, someone's a fan. Nice. Hey, you know, in our arm wrestle, it was undecided who won. So, you know, and it will be undecided until, I don't know, probably a long time. Because we're not going to do that again. And, all right. Oh, if he, if he did the up air there, I reckon he could have, he could have worked. I would have done it. Just saying. My, if my Peach was in that position, I would have up it. I don't know about your Peach. Would your Peach have up it? I don't know, my Peach does some strange things. Okay. You know, sometimes... I McLeod could take some notes because he's down a game. Ooh. I'm pretty sure, like, in a friendly, my Peach pulled a turn up against Caleb. And this is losers, right? Yeah. Sorry for misleading you. What is it, losers quarters, maybe? Or is it round two or something? I'm just typing losers for now, as I'm not sure. This is not a winner's semis match. Yeah. It's just losers. Yeah, it's losers. 
Nice. Forward tilt to forward A. Eh? That's that's a rare combo, I'd say. You don't often see that one. I think he was he was surprised and didn't know what to expect. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't expect that. But like Falcon doesn't really ever forward tilt. No, it was just the right situation for it, and it paid off big time. I Man, a jab. I don't think he meant to jab. You think Probably he could have got something bigger? Yeah. Like dash attack or grab? Yeah. Down through a knee. Oh. Now this is oh. this is the stage I would recommend in this matchup going to. It's just Black Shadow knows how to actually yeah, he's maneuver really, platforms, so yeah. He's really kind of rolling him this game. Yes. I'm pretty sure he's practiced a lot of Falcon, because you see him on Falcon, he does not look like a Falcon. Hmm. What is it about this stage? Where you think it's the good? Uh, this is the choice for the matchup. Um, you mean when you're playing Peach? Oh, I guess I like it because sometimes you can get some scummy down smashes. Oh yeah. Or uppers, or you can um, chain grab, sort of like the bottom is FD sometimes. Damn. And also, lots of falcons are not comfortable on this stage because the platforms, their heights and how they change. Looks like Mark is not one of those falcons though. Yeah. Game one was close, but this is. Pretty bad yeah. in the cloud right now. I mean, this is a best of five, I'm pretty sure. Could be. We might find out very soon. We might see All we know one. is it's in loses. Yeah. The Shadow Realm. <laughs> They're fighting it out. All right. All right. He's bringing it back. Oh, no. Not, it's still pretty, not still not great, but... You can still win with this. It just you can just not those. Not definitely those still win, but it's not in his favor for sure. Yeah. Well, like, this is definitely... This matchup is so volatile, like... Oof, that's gonna hurt. Yeah. When you get shield poked like that, when you are blocking the attack, you, yeah. you get hit anyways. That's a feels bad. It, it's, it feels so good when yeah. you do it, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can... I think you can, like, shield the eye away, or maybe, like... Yeah. like oh, oh! That was... Um, I was not expecting Thought he had the spacing, but McLeod was just one little bit step uh, sharper. McLeod's too good. He's spacing like a pro. He's got, he's got the spacing it takes to win this match. Maybe. Oh, no, not. Oh, never mind. He he's knows going for, like, knee, knee, knee. Honestly. Another knee. Because he knows. Becca is a good yeah. is a good friend to Falcon. He, know, he knows knees. Any knee could be the last one, but I was going to say. Yeah. Mark McLeod was taking advantage. Uh, I don't know. Becca is, like, what you want to go for if... But landing a knee right. is too hard. It is a best of five. Yeah. McLeod, he's had enough of that FD. Oh. Clearly didn't work. Chain I mean, grabs. He's going FD. Enough of that FD. Mm -hmm. I don't agree with, like... I don't know, floating... And he was floating high before. I mean, I do it, so obviously I'm not going to say I'm the better player in that regard, but it's not good. No? No, because, like, Falcon can there. You're, you can't shield, you can't do much. You're sitting duck in the air. Yeah, and that's pretty good. It's yeah. one of my favorite moves of that character. Yeah. Oh? Ooh. Good good, good start finished. from a cloud. You think Caleb would get hit there? I think Caleb's... Uh, that's one area Caleb has above Black Shadow. Maybe he could... I don't know. I uh, know. Caleb does dash. some things at times, and then other times he I potatoes. I just think his hack stash is uh, more practiced. Well... To be fair, I'm like he's definitely practiced that more than any other Falcon in the story. I Yeah, that's probably true. Like I would I would not be surprised if if that was a fact. Could very well be a fact. <laughs> you heard it here folks. It could you heard it here first <laughs> folks. It could very well be a fact. Cause like We both agree. He does it so much. Hey, he loves it. Yeah. Like, that grab was ridiculous. You see that? Yeah. He snatched her right out of the air. People say Falcon's grab is bad. What's going on here? It's um, it's sort of behind, like peaches. That was like up and above. Yeah, it's. it's okay. Well, McLeod making him pay with that turn up. Yep. This is going pretty good for McLeod, honestly. Yeah. Though. Kind of needs it to at this point. Yeah. Get back a bit of morale. Yeah. Well, it's like, like, yeah, I can do it. I can beat this guy. Well, the thing Ooh, is, that's huge. if a club wins this, he's got like a Yoshi or a Stadium game. Mm. Plenty, Another perfectly one. doable. Yep. I would imagine Stadium. But Stadium, Stadium is so shit in this match of the speech. Yeah. 
pretty good. It feels bad. You get friend by Falcon, the stage is too small to feel comfortable, but too wide to stop Falcon from moving. Really? Well, what makes uh, Yoshi good for Falcon, though? Um, I know, this is just my personal opinion, but I, I feel threatened because Falcon can just at some point run at me and knee or nair like or up you're, and there. you're always in range. Yeah. Fair enough. Nice juggle. Like, you got down smash as Peach, but like, yeah. it, it's, n it's definitely not what you need. Yeah. It's not invincible for sure. Yeah. Especially like better players like Mark will actually either wait or space around it. Yeah, they're ready for. They've seen it before. Yeah. All right. So it's good to know that like the Cloud he just keeps a lead. Have we seen a chain grab this game? I don't think he's. I don't think the Cloud's actually really grabbed Mark. Yeah, interesting. I think he's grabbing once a chain grab. Perhaps trying to use the threat of it more so than the actual uh, grab. Yeah. Well, getting oh. a getting a grab's actually hard. This is pretty big. Yeah. But Oh, oh no, my no. god. Oh, okay, he's got double jump. Oh. oh no down smash. Oh god. Yeah, that's too high. You gotta be thinking Cloud's feeling the pressure at this point. Oh that's He's feeling the burn. Oh, did he not have a float? That's not Oh it's grabbed. Doesn't F get doesn't yeah. mash out. Takes three O. Yeah. Damn. Impressive. Yeah, maybe maybe a bit of nerves coming into play. Does he does he mm. normally because, of course, that last down through knee looked escapable. Maybe. But didn't. Well, we probably could have escaped it with a certain DI and, you know. Air dodge so, out? So, you know. Yeah. Yeah, air dodge out, but maybe mm. a bit of nerves, you know. I know I would have been nervous in that situation. Yeah. McLeod looks like Marty. He kind of does mm. look like Marty McFly. Mm? A little bit. You know Marty McFly from the, what's it called, um, Back to the Future? Oh, uh, no. Okay. Well, that's a movie. I know. There's a guy. McLeod kind of... He has the same eyes, I think. And somewhat similar facial structure, I Oh, think. he has the pretty eyes and face. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, we're playing now. Oh, yeah. Hell, yeah. <sighs> All right. Next set, me versus Catherine. She's won the last couple. I don't know how many it's been now. We used to go back and forth a bit more, but you know, see if I can bring it back this this time. Sorry. What? Oh, brawls on. You sure that isn't just Project M? Oh, it could be. That might that might just be some brawl over there. Come down, come down now for some brawl action. If you're into that. will do it. Ow. Fuck it. Ugh. Alright, Peach Moth. Probably end up on Battlefield, unless it's one of these matchups where Peach has three good stages, but I don't think it is. If anything, it's the other way around. some point. Right. 
Sure is a battlefield matchup. Are they just gonna go into it? Nope. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Uh, someone's rumbling. Not anymore, there ain't. Pro tip, just rip the fucking thing out of your controller. It's so much lighter as well, it's so good. You never have to think about silly Falcon mains leaving it on or anyone else that does that. I can just press A to get out of combos if it's on. Yes, Catherine was looking real good until she got hit there. Now it's classic Mark Beach where, I don't know, about to say, where it feels like you can get out and you just can't. Well, I don't have a problem with it anymore, but I've got a problem with people that complain about it. It's just like, fucking take the thing out if you're not going to use it. It's real easy, you just cut the cords. Classic moth reaction. I'll hit that every time. Best chance grab though, though. Let's love that one. Yeah, you'd be surprised. People hate the rumble, man. or if she just caught his time. Yeah. Too late in the day to be commentating this. Mm -hmm. yeah, no forgets how to RP properly. She's gonna do this and then. <laughs> Interesting, Catherine didn't pull back to get a jump there. I didn't spot where. I wasn't really gonna do all that. Six spot dodge light. Oh, grabs her out of the down smash. That's a risky one. Yeah, that's what normally happens. Uh, Catherine waiting. Probably should have pummeled, considering. Uh, yeah, that's a bad side B, and he gets punished for it. Dash attacks first set. We used it early. Now that was a fucking brilliant update. It didn't do anything, but the fact that she hit ledge cancel the light about made it way safer than it looked.
All right, Catherine takes game one. This is fun. Now, I wonder if we go into the flat one, or if we go into Yoshi's. Yoshi's. Ready? Go. <laughs> See ya. Uh, that was an alarm there. Can't get greedy like that, cat. Hey. Okay, yeah. Good moth. Kinda gets to do whatever he wants at this point. Let's you let her come down with back air. Not jump canceling zones, what's going on? Ooh, yeah, that was a good forward smash, kind of just spaced around it. And... Oh, actually, he could have lived that if he had upbeat again. Because <laughs> of the turn up hitting the shy guy. Might have sent him inwards. really messing up these jumps and that was a dot eyes. That kind of sucks. Stage, yeah. She had that one coming. She's done the same edge guard like three or four times. Lemons is just kind of going, well, if you're going to do that, I'm just going to go around it. How did no one hit anyone there? Yeah. Bad time to be pulling turn. Oh, that was bad. Will D hits that second bounce after that. That's where does not. Yeah. Oh, Lemons almost jumps straight into that turn. Gets around it though. Oh no. Oh no. The full stop lead is just gone. That's unfortunate. The moon shielding so long, I guess. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, you got up at that. Come on, Lance. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is back. Makes sense. He was winning that whole game. Oh no. Lemons, why?
surprised I killed, but you know, that's what I needed. That was really good there, actually. Holy crap. Oh, I didn't need it. Never mind. Much better recovery. I'm just looking at a lot better this game. But he's still getting hit by that stuff like that, so I don't know. Catherine Di is the worst way. Full zipper. Alright, let's with a full stop blade. I'm just kind of planning on staying completely grounded, which is all fun and games until Peach run up down smashes. that coming. He didn't do any of the Mewtwo King fade back forward edge. Yeah. Yeah. Doing a good job standing up at range there, but not going to do a whole lot if she doesn't go down to neutral. Oh, here we go. Man, is that umbrella strong for one percent? Oh, the idea was there. I mean, forward smash would have been better, but still. I got to do it. Yes, it is. Lemons on the board. <laughs> Now we go to Dreamland, which is... Yeah. Oh, why did he dash back there? You can't do anything with the turnip. Big. Okay, that was an interesting situation. It just immediately lands and gets a down smash for it. That's that stuff you gotta really avoid as a boss in this matchup. Is getting caught in dumb situations that end up with you getting down smashed. Oh yeah, that's gonna go. Can't be copping dollar eyes like that. Not a lot you can do about it, I don't think, because I think if you up B or forward air, you still get hit by it. It's just too, too strong. Ooh, oh, that was a grab. Oh. from that. Good shove. Lemons is going to hold on to this stock for a lot longer than 
He has been so far. That was a really good lift up. I can't believe she dodged that down. Didn't dodge that tip of those. He's gotten a few of those. Uh, uh, Lemon's bringing this back. But he's got to figure out a way of t either taking the stocks early or live into 150 plus every stock. Otherwise, he's not going to be the feature of the Good tech. Fortunate on Lemon's part that he mistimes that. Yeah. Catherine won too many air dodges on stage. Yeah. Lemon's covers it. Catherine doesn't go at the right height anyway, so. Yeah. Lemon's really all over that last stop. She kind of called out what she was going to do. Oh, this is a bad spot. You don't want to be on the ground with a turnip. stage without a real combo, but, you know, take 50 damage when you can get it, that's for damn sure. And that's the dog. Should have been. Good old Marth Beach taking six minutes on Dreamland. Here we go. Yeah. She dies for it. Okay. Yeah, you can't do that against Marth. It's too fast. Surprised he didn't just go for the down air there. Or there. He had ample opportunity to just try to end it. Yeah, no reactions. Ooh, Stitch, this is interesting. Yeah, can't pivot tip it there. Yeah. Evan's working on a reverse 3 0. Interesting. It's like he heard Nick through the chat and has remembered how this matchup goes. So what you've missed so far oh. was Catherine going up to O, Nick screaming in the chat, someone tell Liam that Marth beats Peach. It's and man. no one told him. Now, but he's, now, he, you know, now, he's on the reverse 3 0 anyway. He's figuring it out. Oh I wonder where we're going. One sec. Let's go, Cap. Complete bias commentary. I'm 50% yeah. bias commentary. Yeah, that sounds about right. We're going after. Oh, Ooh, I don't know about this. Dreamland <laughs> did go poorly. I would have gone. Mm. Ooh, where do you go? Probably FOD. Dude, yeah. Stadium. Again? What? Yeah, stadium. People aren't listening. It's Against Marth? Amada does it. Yeah, Amada's. Yeah, I know. Like, uh, Amada's proving a point. I think she's just one of the platforms to do with like Liam throwing out her smashes and up tilts. Yeah. Like you, this is definitely a Marth counterpick stage, but at least this level, especially if you um. But Catherine has a pretty decent understanding of the ground game against Marth. Yeah, she was kind of getting minced up on the Yoshi's game, mm. or the second Yoshi's game on the platforms. 
So Dream Lantern just kind of got outplayed. Yeah. So. Yeah, a lot more of that happened earlier in the set. And later in the set, Lemons just like kept her at tipper range the whole time. I was like, oh yeah, how does Peach get past? Oh, that's such a bad. Yeah, that was bad. Like, you can't do it when P uh, Marth is that high. You gotta go for like throw turn up to try to push him back. And Pretty much, yeah. Him. You gotta like dissuade him from. Ooh, yep. Ah, uh, yeah. What are we going? Yeah, back throw, bro. I mean, because, like, down throw. Oh, no. no. He's got a back air. Yeah, no back air. I mean, you could up air there as well, but back air is yeah. the good one. Now, this is all about just, like, trying to attack on as much percent as you can before you get, um... Yeah. You have to really space that um, up air properly as Peach with that percent, or you just end up getting combo Ooh. broken. Ooh. Now, yeah, this is where it's like, oh, come yeah, on. Yeah, that was such... Uh, yeah, that happens a lot. When you try and go for a dash attack just a little bit too fast and yeah. you buff the F tilt. Well, not buff, but like. Oh, yeah, he's like. Ooh. Nice power shield grab. Oh, but that's not a reaction to one. No. And the thing is, if I'm Catherine, I'm just always taking away against Marth here because Liam just. Like, he he's really fishing for his F smash. Like, yeah, these S-Match yeah. reads on Tekken. Oh, why would you grab it? Yeah, if, if you're grabbing it, you need to, like, immediately drop it. Yeah. Ooh. Uh. All right, how is Peach landing? Yeah, yeah she's not. not. <laughs> she's not. Amada's amazing at just getting that pixel-perfect height where it avoids... um. Marth's full hop up here, but oh, you good got, mashup. You got a CC stick in that. Oh yeah, it's so good. I thought we were getting another lemon special there. If I'm Catherine, I'm just always staying here. And just like you don't like this. Oh, okay, that's okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, it's all making more sense. Yeah. Now. If a stitch, then yeah, you just. Why would you fare? That's like. Problem is now Catherine's. At this point, I'm. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, he, he forgot it's a stitch and he can't challenge that shit. Yeah, he's probably trying to grab it. I think he was trying to, like, jab it out of the way. You think? I think yeah. he was definitely trying to grab it. Liam still... Well, like, the jab came out. Hmm. Uh, okay, good. Good, like... Yeah, she fell for that earlier in the set, so... Yeah, honestly, yeah. you roll. You're going to get hit probably regardless, so you might as well get knocked all the way on the other side of the stage. Lemons would be so much better at killing Peach if he had the reactions. Mm. Hit that forward smash. Yeah, he was trying to do that, and he forgot that... You can't? Okay. You definitely can't against Stitches. Just because oh, they that beat a, everything. That no, I think that was another Stitch. Oh, that was not meant to be an up smash, I'm going to guess. you, you got to think that's an up kill. Oh, no, he's got to turn up. Oh, he... Yeah, he's going to close it out. Now, you know... You can't get too no, you, ahead of yourself. with how this set's gone, it's just like, mm. eh. just, You don't want to do any dumb, like, dash tech near the ledge. Get grabbed, get down for, you know, down, down tilted. Down for a tip or something. Yeah. And just you just want to do this. You just want to abuse your excellent stage positioning uh, and just uh, I gotta keep go on chucking. Before I play. Yep. All right. So... Yeah, the stage, <laughs> the stage actually working out. Catherine picking it pretty much for that reason, just to abuse the ground game and throw turnips. And at the level they're at right now, um, Liam like doesn't have the greatest anti-turnip game. Particularly not just like dealing with the actual turnip, but like punishing Peach for actually pulling a turnip. Um, once he improves on that, he'll definitely find himself doing a lot better on these sort of like flat stages. But he still won the Dreamland game, so... And kept it to a game five, so good on to him. Um, I believe we're up to winners finals now again. So that would be uh, Kai versus Jack. All right. Mm. Oh yeah, and on comms we have Muska.
Oh, wait, are they doing losers? Are you commentating? You're disappointed, the Dad. The shittest player in the world. What did I? What do you want me to explain? I could probably come up with some some excuse. Man, I tried to grab that stitch, but I uh, mistimed it. Okay, so you weren't so. I wasn't. I knew. I knew the jab wasn't going to work. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's I what I assumed. Try and grab it. That's what I assumed. Yeah. Um, trying. You know, last time I played here in the tournament, I did grab a stitch and killed her with it. I think. Mm. Well, maybe I would think it will be. Either way. Yeah, why weren't you playing Pikachu? Uh, Explain to our... I don't like the character that much. Yeah. And I don't have much experience either, so... Well, know, maybe you should. really a no-brainer. I don't really like Pikachu. It's, um... You know, against Fox. Peach, it's exactly what you want. I think I'd rather play Fox. I'm gonna be right back. I'm just gonna get my bottle of water. Yeah. Hold on. Let me scroll up. What are you gonna... Oh, why isn't letting me scroll up? Should let me scroll up. Go back to Dreamland. Lemons, you're sucking. Peach wins. Mouth Peach Peach in Dreamland. Yeah, probably. Sloth like reactions. Yes. Yes. I, I've told you this many times, Nick. I don't. I never react to anything. It's always a read. It's always a read. Somehow lose this. I don't know. Was that for game three? I don't know. Or whatever. Game two. Game four. Because I won that. How come every time you do double four, you do full drifting four to get punished for 100% of the time? Never act to anything, and 100% of your reads Damn, are wrong. You know, sometimes look. they're right. So that, I, that's, that's <laughs> the wrong I can ignore the rest of it. It's uh, harsh, but it's good advice, I'd say. Why do I always drift forward? Because I'm not very good. It's not, smart, it's not always a smart thing to do. I don't know. I'm gambling there. Yes. I don't know. Probably don't think about it that much. I haven't, I haven't thought about melee in, in, you know since five minutes ago. I was, I was thinking about it before when I was, I was like, how am I going to kill her? And then I thought, I'll do this. And then it did. Anyway, like it. Anyway. up next we have the um, EVAC Winner's Quarters Classic. Now in Winner's Finals because half our scene freaking showed up after six, myself included. So normally these guys are... Well, in a tournament when Nick shows up, it's usually fourth and fifth seed. Like me. I think you'll find I did try and like wait for certain things. But my reactions aren't there, right? Like I said, no reactions. Anyway, what? What are you? We we we're all here, is what you're saying? Everyone's we're here. We're all here now, <laughs> not so except for now. Um, but yeah, the uh, both these guys are playing in winners finals. We got we're gonna get hopefully a hype five game set, and not just three games of either Kyle or Jack winning. I mean... Kai's definitely... Well, Kai's... They've both looked mortal. They sure have. They sure have. They've sure both dropped games. Maybe Flareats will switch to the Peach. Maybe, you know... The trifecta. Put the fear in him. You know, there's days... Well, there's taunt, like, taunts when I'm watching uh, Jack play Kai, and he's doing well Sheik, I'm like, man... This seems a lot easier than Fox Falco. Why don't I just play Sheik down? You know... Inevitably go back to the box. Yeah, I don't know. Right, so watching you makes me feel some way. Same way as watching the moon. <laughs> I don't know. I would maybe appreciate that more if I'd watched the moon in a while. Because I actually don't even remember the last time I watched a melee tournament. I haven't seen. I, to be honest, I've been watching a decent amount of melee recently. I haven't actually seen the moon in quite a while. Yeah. I, I, I don't think I've seen him do very well while you're, He was like He's notable, cool. but I don't know it anymore. I don't think so. It really, you know, went downhill once he embraced his heritage and called himself La Luna. Right. It was just, you know, it was I all downhill. Like, well, you know, he, 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 loses, became big yeah. on the, he became big on the meme. Well, yeah, the moon, I feel like the last time I do remember seeing him, he lost. Uh, he, like, choked the set that way and lost. Or, or he was just getting outplayed. It was one of the two. He lost. He wasn't looking that good. I don't remember who it was. Ooh. Invincible up smash. Nice. Oh man, he's yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, he did too. He lost to that DK player. I mean, that's a, probably a rough matchup, right? DK mark. <laughs> Is it? It might be. I mean, you know. I wouldn't, you know. DK has got these big guns. No, no, no. How are you gonna stop that gorilla from beating down your beating not down bad your door? Mark, but in? it might be one of DK's better matchups. I have no idea. It feels like it. Man, melee must not be fair then. I don't know. I've. 
And I'm literally the worst player. Right, Jack's down at full stock, but all he needs is one back throw. At this point, it's like a bit more percent and a dash tech and, you know, comboing into a fair and he'll be sitting pretty, but yeah. right now Falco's doing his auto combo. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, He's bringing oh. back his own auto combo. Damn. This one takes the stock. Nerf. All right, yeah, just... <laughs> yeah, the moon, I've never seen the moon put up results in melee. That's true. Ah, he's burnt his jump. I mean, that is actually kind of sad that that he said the moon and he thought of the literal moon before he thought of the melee player. He's really fallen out of the public mind's yet. Damn, that's rough. Oh. Yeah, Jack loves to go for that runoff, um, runoff stage, double jump there, back on stage, and nice scouting it out. And nice. I had some, had some nice yeah. laser forward smashes these this uh, today. Just, just, Jack's just kind of been like drifting towards uh, ledge, just a bit too close for hitting the up B, and Kai's just punishing him for it. He's just grabbing ledge and doing ledge up bear. Straight to fountain. It's not something you see that often, that bear. So it usually it'll catch you off guard when you don't, when you're not expecting it. It, but like against Sheik, it's weird because um, she's got you the do invincible it. Yeah, too, so. if she like, oh, oh, is this punished? Good. All right, that's actually it's a good start. Um, if you see that last part, like so Kai is up one. Game. Some sheiks don't do that. At least it's like around this level, some sheiks don't do that. Um, up being then immediately angle it's like above to go to ledge. Right. And just kind of let Falco get back. But, uh, uh, down smash? Yeah, no arms attack though by Jack. Like, it's hard. Like, to. Well, it's not hard to execute, but you just need to be aware. Arms attacks. Is that what you said? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, for the down smash? Oh, yeah. Yeah, because um, typically Falco is going to grab a ledge and then just stand and get up to like cover Sheik going to ledge. How do you and, uh, hold your sticks for the arm stack? Isn't it's it? Just, it's just like... Is it straight down? Or? It's like, what? Straight um, down the C stick and down into the stage? Right. Like, towards the stage. Um, so down and, down and in. Yeah, down on the C stick and down and in. Then holding L. And then you go time attack. Yep. Yes. Damn. Okay. It's clean. Yeah. Just not letting him get away with any any technical. It's got to be crisp. Otherwise, Jack's going to find a way in and take your stock. So Jack, once again, Jack, for whatever reason, either he's really good at landing these grounded needles or people are just really bad at, like, Reacting to Jack throwing out these grounded needles, but he's getting a like clean 17% a lot, and that's really big for Sheik, especially considering that Jack's um, punish game off a of grab isn't that good. So, getting just that like a bit more out of CC percent. That down air worked out really crazy. nicely for Jack, but oh, it's still bad. oh, okay, doesn't gets a knockdown, but doesn't quite punish appropriately. Damn. Go for Go. <laughs> Break up. Oh, do you see that? He went for some crisp stuff. Ledge dash, turn around up still. Yeah, yeah. Kai goes nice. for that a lot. There he goes again. Going the extra above and beyond. Like, Kai's ledge dash is uh, quite solid, so. Probably one of the, one of the better ones. Definitely. Yeah. So we're last dog. This is always terrifying for the Spacey. Kai actually shielding the needles this time around. Look. No. Look, look, mate. I don't see that often. I don't watch Melee enough to see it off. No. Maybe I'm, I'm definitely oh. behind the times. What can I say? Alright, this is... This is a bit awkward because even if Jack wins this game now, he's going to deal with two FD games and... That's not what you want as Sheik? No. But you know, god damn it, he's got to try. Then again, you had to deal with two Dreamland games. And not only did you win the first one, but you did good enough to convince the Peach to go to a different stage. So, who knows? Yeah. yeah. Nothing that says we 
won't see Jack win this, then free stock Kion FD game four, and then 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 be like wait a minute, I gotta pick, I gotta go to like you know then lose on Yoshi's or something. Congo Jungle. Congo Jungle, yeah. I gotta bust out something he's never seen before. Damn. The cheat codes to unlock the hidden stages. <laughs> yeah. But. He'll activate the master. He'll swap to port three and activate the master hand glitch. Oh. Oh no. no. Okay, well. <laughs> that looks really bad. I can sort of see why Kai was, um, why Jack was hesitant a little bit there because in his mind he's probably thinking, what can I, for like a split second he's probably thinking, what can I do that won't result in Falco immediately just taking the stage and then wall jumping? Right? Like, it's a puzzle. Oh, doesn't need that one. Oh. No? Alright. Yeah. I just realized we should add your name to my name. The comps. I don't know. I'm not sure if I'm a qualified. Okay, for his a bit stronger. Good trade. Okay, what's he getting off this? Uh, to be honest, actually, I'm not sure if that um, F2 would have been ACI down anyway. I'm not sure what percent Falco can ACI down F2, but. It's probably fairly high. Yeah. It's getting close early, if, it's, if not already. Oh no, not the chain. That's. <laughs> Alright. Um, Jack kind of is going for that fair down smash and it's somehow working out. Yeah. Oh, uh, that, okay, that was, Excellent. that was really good. Yeah, a huge part of winning these, winning games in tournaments is just staying calm. Yeah, and honestly. Not, not letting things, you know, not letting yourself get flustered. Mm. And you know, often enough your opponent might just end up, if they're getting it flustered, they're just going to do something dumb and you just, you just need to remain calm, punish. You kill them and it'll take you very far. Mentality is huge. Um, even at like locals where, I mean, these people aren't playing for very much in the line, no. but it doesn't really matter how much you're playing for. People can yeah. still get flustered just still get by nervous. messing up, execution errors, yeah. thinking for, uh, I should be playing better than this. Textbook example, refer to Musket versus Cal. Hey, that was, that was more on the line than that. That was... Oh, textbook example. Textbook. See this match yeah, right yeah. now. All right, Jack's just and in Jack's mind he's like, "All right, yep. I can get a grab. I can, I can get grab. this grab. If I get this grab. It doesn't matter. I need to get this grab. Who am I to get this grab? Oh, okay. It doesn't get the um reverse down air. But now Kai, Kai's thinking, I can get a back air. I can get a back air. He wants to grab, but I can get, I'm gonna get a back air. Oh, you got a grab. What's he gonna get off it? Ah. Oh. Yeah. See. I was getting a little bit scared, a little bit stuck in his shield. Yeah. If this was less. If this was Davin playing, I'd be like, oh god, Kai's gonna. <laughs> but still. Oh, oh he's so he's dead. dead. Oh, he's totally dead. He's gotta be but dead. That right was now. such a good up air. Oh, nice that was reverse. actually so good. Staying calm, collected, and he's Man, in the set. He's that's... on the board. Two one. Okay. Oh, that was such a. Now he's gonna. Now he's gonna go into the the two FD games. Yep. He wants to win. It's all coin and script. He's gonna free stock here, and then Kai's gonna win on Yoshi's. That might be what it needs. What needs to happen. Kai starting out pretty strong. Not not letting that get to him. Yeah. Bit Kai? of a nod. Nod from Flores. He knew. He yep. got. He got baited. He should. Kai loves doing fade away aerial in Tef Smash. Yeah. He's been doing that. I think, I think he tried to up tilt there. I thought like he tried to up tilt. He turned around and did full hop. I think he tried to up tilt there. It would have, perhaps, as Sheik was kind of coming down. Maybe. A little bit of an error. Ooh. Trying to dash away. Sheik grab reach him. That's unfortunate. But so the thing about Jack is that Jack, um, his shield drop game isn't that great. So FD isn't quite as big of a nerf to. Oh, that's. Yeah, he's cooking. He's cooking. Yeah, so FD isn't quite as big of a nerf to his Sheik as, um, say, other more conventional Sheiks like, say, Damon. He's not. He's a different style. He's, he's a different focused style. On the, 
No, let's focus more on the grounded needles. Grounded needles. Let's see. Oh, 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 just puts the fear in him. Not ready for that, dude. Oh, oh, oh. What a clang. Oh, that was yeah. so... God. Kai, he's definitely looking a little bit, you know, used to just tuck some things in. Just start, yeah. He's, he's a bit calm. He's looking a All little right. bit lost every now and then, but... Oh, really good anti up here. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, do you think, uh, do you think that was wise? That, uh... Oh, oh. I, was say, I think maybe you should have stayed on the ledge, or do you think that was a good idea? Wait. It's also against Jack because like Jackals can still mix up with um like Edo John. Mm. I think I think you, you can probably well depends how he does it. Potentially he could have um did, done something like stand get up and then wave dash back on. Oh, big Ooh. damage but not quite enough. Yeah, gets that awkward hit of the down smash that just kind of pops him up just a little bit but doesn't really do much. Really good up here actually. Yeah. He really needs to stock. Ah. Uh, he should have just needled. Yeah, he could have reacted to that faster, but he definitely would have. Nice. These DI mix up. Yeah, these reverse bears are actually. Yeah, actually real, so real good. Kill yeah. Oh, but no. Drift. Nice. Wow, it doesn't kill that. Yeah, <laughs> that, that feels so bad for Falco. He's trying to work his way in with a needle. But. Okay, I was expecting the dodge from Jack there. Yeah, but he reversed, but he's still still not gonna make it back. Mm. Okay. All right, last dog. Last dog, down two to one in an unfavorable stage, but it's definitely possible. The F tilt grab working out. Um, guy's definitely flubbing. Uh, he's no, he's like, not playing as clean as he was once was. It's also his defensive options. Like once he's once he's once he's put in a situation, he's not quite as sharp on the draw. It doesn't immediately. This is what I gotta do. Doesn't matter if you keep hitting. If you keep hitting Sheik and knocking off stage. It's Still, he's doing a great job this stuff. He's taking barely any percent. Sheik's okay. He re Jack really needs this. And ah, uh, this. Uh, All right, keep it simple. Just have smashing off. Yeah, I think that's about nice. it. Ledge. There we go. Oh, okay. one more chance, maybe. Yeah. Roll away, pretty safe there. He kind of requires a bit of a pretty hard call out. I don't think Jack's quite. I don't think Jack's that comfortable with his needle turnarounds. At least in that spot. And to be fair, in a like more high pressure situation, it's easy to try and go for the the easy option. Trying to get. I got a jump. Oh, oh uh, clip. That's ready for that. Okay. Oh. All right. <laughs> this. Nah, this is where you really got to stay calm. Yeah. yeah. This if is. If you're Falco right now, you're gonna be thinking, "Well, I'm in the lead. I just gotta, you know, just relax." You know. Yeah, yeah. If I'm Falco, if I'm Fox or Falco, I'm just never going to that ledge. There's yeah. no reason. Like, why? <laughs> why would you? Oh, okay. <sighs> a dash attack. Oh. Oh, he jumps oh into the it. jump. I think he has to Zelda. No jump. No, he, he just had to Zelda. Damn. Oh. There you go. 3 1. Kai makes it to grand finals. Right? This is one of his finals. Yes. Uh, what happened to you? Pun? What happened to you? What do you mean? I didn't show up. Oh, what? I, I, can't yeah, I, I, I was one of the like five or six people that showed up at like six because uh, of other commitments. You know what happened to me? You didn't realize I'd enter this tournament. He's like, "Huh, Musk got knocked out and like loses round two or what something." What the hell? What the hell? What's going on here? All right, we're up to. All right, this is losers semis. Yep. Low uh, Have how much? How should they play before? I don't really remember. Uh, what? Like, Catherine. They're and they're head to head. They haven't played that much. To be fair, Mark doesn't show up to that much. I believe Mark won the last one. Catherine won. I want to say Mark's even won the last one or two, and Catherine won the one before those. He's definitely still the favorite. Mm. Oh, yeah, definitely. But I don't think it's... I mean, Catherine's had some, you know, she's had Caleb to practice against. <laughs> it's a, just a little bit different type of Falco. Not Falco, definitely Falcon. Different, different type, type of, of Falco. Yeah, definitely have different types of Falco, but yeah, different I mean, type of Falcon. You can still, you know, apply some of it, for mm -hmm. sure. It's better than nothing. 
That's true. Yeah. That's true. Probably. <laughs> it's, it's um, yeah. At least uh, some of the punishes. Uh, how do they? All right, Catherine yeah. doing a hand warmers, yep. making sure the C6 working. It's pretty important. Yeah. <laughs> the key. Now, Catherine, Catherine does have some like tech that. Yeah, looks showing off now. A little bit of movement. I was thinking more so the double jump lands and just yes. improving. Um, I love double jump lands with Peach. Mm. Oh no! What? Oh, you're trying to? Okay. Oh no! Wait. Right. So she's just. She's just. Let's not. Let's not work on shield dropping. No. Or I mean, more importantly, these days, let's not work on um, float, floating aerials out of shield. Let's work on wave. I can just imagine there's gonna Look, be one spot in this. I think she's practicing the matchup a little bit more than you have recently. I'm sure she's onto something with this. And she wins. She's done better than me recently like, in um, Peach Falcon. Yeah. When 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 she baits out a Falcon punch and, and wave lands. Wave lands off. Yeah. Fares. To win the set. I'm trying to think of what percent Falcon would need to be to actually die, like in that spot. On the left side of the stage, dying off the right to a fair. Probably like one, 150, one. What if, I mean, low percent, you may be like up air into a combo, right? At low percent? Maybe. Ooh. Ooh, really good. Like, this hits the down smash and just immediately goes for, looks for the tech chase. Mark trying to cover her going low, but she just goes straight over him. So this matchup is Peach, he's, like, it feels so scary jumping. Oh, yes. this needs to, oh, okay, it doesn't quite get it. Falcon Air, extremely good against Peach when she's floating there. Mm. Falcon Air, Falcon Up Air. With his speed, he can just kind of get in there. Gotta be careful. Yeah, like, platforms are, <laughs> like, it's really awkward getting down, like, trying to navigate to center stage or, like, just to stage. Speech when she's on platforms. Okay. Wait. Yeah, How's she getting just killed? Yeah, Falcon's knee is pretty strong. Strong move. Ah, he's gonna kill. That was terrible. Yeah. Was, was he? Was he expecting? I think he just was, didn't like, react. Up, up throw. I guess. He just didn't react. I think fast enough. Fast enough to like Peach's board throw comes out pretty fast, and if you don't um. If you don't pummel, oh. then you can catch people out occasionally. That that up B grab that feels bad. Whenever whenever ha whenever you get hit by that, when he's trying to trying to just get a falcon, that's always it feels bad. Like oh yeah, oh, that shouldn't yeah. happen. But, but this piece shouldn't happens. be getting hit by it generally. You should yeah. be um, yeah, you know, kind of spacing yeah. around it. You have good enough hitboxes that you can deal with. Now it's brought him back into the game. Mm. I think he was ever out of it. Like, but oh, this needs to be a. Mark yeah, that's a pretty scary character in that way, and then he, he, he can, he's, you know, always a little bit away from getting back to the game because he's so strong at killing. And, you know, gets a couple of good hits, you get slightly bad DI, and all of a sudden you're like, oh god. Yeah. You get into that mindset. Ooh, really good double jump land, tech yes. chase. But now nice. Falcon's, Falcon should just be tech. Okay, well, you can even do that. You can hope that, like, the Peach messes up, or you can just kind of. Um, DI to top flat and then just tech away, and it's really hard for Peach to get a uh, guaranteed follow up. You could, you can like double jump land, like tech chase him, right? You can double jump land, but if, Falcon, but if Falcon techs away, then it's, um, it's not guaranteed. Either. Pretty much. You then, it's a mix up based on whether Falcon immediately shield drops or hold shield. Oh, this is. Okay. Well, Catherine was definitely in a really old position, but. Mark doesn't contest, he just kind of gives up the legend, goes back to center. Captain's up in this game one. Mmm, pretty solid. Like, one one hit, like, yeah, like that. Captain's a heavy boy, though. Basically dead. Almost. Captain's a heavy boy, and Captain's not the most comfortable edge guarding Captain, I'd say. Yeah. He could be a little bit tricksy. Mmm. She doesn't really want to contest when Falcon's just immediately just drifting back to um Goes for the moonwalk. to ledge. Even without using his double jump, just kind of lets Falcon like slowly fall to ledge and then goes from there. Okay, and that's why I think you have to like up there maybe. I don't know. Whatever. That, Close. that was pretty scary. That was almost like horrendous for Falcon. If he was, then he was a little bit slower and he gets hit by the down smash. Mm. That's like. 
Damn, that's how you start in your last duck. Oh no, no way. That was... Still looking good for him. Okay. Weird now. Definitely should have been a um, up at that percent. I feel. Nice. Ooh, that was actually a really cool. Um, oh. Oh. This... She didn't die in there, so. Ah, uh, definitely, definitely didn't want to hit that reverse now, but. Oh, oh. oh this guy is slippery. I don't know if it's going to be enough, though. Ooh, that oh. was such a good... Yeah, she, that was a really good dash attack. She that, was ready for it. Mm, the dash attack hitbox lasts for ages, and even if you get the weak hit against Falcon, it's still, like... It's still enough just to put him in a really awkward situation. Man, I'll tell you, that is that is one of the more... One of the more uh, tilting things against Peach mm. is because it's so long lasting. If you if you like, da if, if she whiffs it and then you like, oh, turn a definite punish and it just barely. That's probably one of the most tilting things. But luckily, it's on the offense. Okay, Mike had her in the corner, then just kind of dashes away and <laughs> gives up stage. And yeah, he's wild. It can be scary, and it's like kind of awkward against Peach because you don't really want to be at like super close range against her, like on the ground, because her grounded options are like her grounded burst options are significantly better than. Throws it away. Yeah. This is still best of five, so even if he loses this game, he's still in it. But I mean, with that sock one, and yeah, Mark could very well close this out. True. Like, right now, and then we're back to even. You'll see, he went back to Battlefield. What do you think? See if that's still a lane, right? right? I think those are Falcon's two best stages in the matchup, man. What about Stadium? Catherine thinks it's pretty <coughs> bad for Peach. Mm, yeah, gee, that's... that too. It's not like there's any bans. Mm. I guess he was really confident in this stage. Like, I think triplets against Peach in this matchup are really good. Peach? Yeah. There's not many matchups, honestly, where, like, yeah. the character doesn't want triplets against Peach. True. Even, you know, even against characters with like, kind of like just okay vertical mobility is just a, a part of Peach. So. Mm. And characters like Falcon and other spa like species yeah. that can just kind of get back to, yeah, they can, they can retreat the top platform and then just easily get back to stage. Yeah. It's <laughs> it can be hard. Oh. Low crush. That was a low crush. <laughs> For all the second fans out there. Oh, this ah, uh, just like Turnip is probably the right choice in that spot. Just needs to um probably do a bit of a softer throw. Like, softer throw. Yeah. More finesse. Because she did smash throw there and it just went like straight over since it um it was at a high speed, so it didn't have enough. Like by the time it started like descending a little bit, it was softer throw would have. Anyway, that's not important. What's important is that. They've evened it up. Well, yeah. Mark's evened it up. Um. Ah, Running shit. all the way past him. What do you, do you think he, she was... I think she had the right idea. She like was dashing and she expected the get-up attack. Shielded. The problem is she didn't do any decent option out of shield. She didn't do like a float bear out of shield. That's good. I'm glad that like... She had a sort of a read on the tech away, but not quite. It didn't do any like over... Didn't do any greedy dash attack to try and cover it and then inevitably get shielded. Oh, knockdown, but. Finds a way in. That's still a pretty big hit. <laughs> Did you see that reverse jab by Peach? That looked so awkward. What the hell? Oh, oh this is. Walk. Not giving him what he needs. Ah, oh, just gets clipped. Right. Catherine's had two or so knock. Oh, that's it, I think. That's that's it. Yeah, bad that's DI. That's a slap to the face. Catches the Falcon out. Hey, that is not gonna not gonna do waters for you eventually. No, but that. Oh. Okay. Still even. This is really close. Yeah. You were expecting it to be this close? I was expecting it to be close. I was expecting Mark to be... Honestly, I was expecting Mark to probably be in Catherine's position right now. 
yeah. as well. Like they're both keeping it close, but Mark's just getting the edge. But Mark doing doing a bit of a Caleb impression. Mm. Oh, oh. Really good bear to stuff out the uh, Falcon yeah. throws, but this kind of tries to go wild. Gets uh, hit. This has been Cameron's problem for pretty much for ages now. Just knocks him off, but doesn't quite seal it. Oh, this that should be pretty. Oh, oh no, that should really have been it. Oh, that's. I almost thought she was going to get battlefielded there. Oh, and the dash attack was really bad as well. At this percent, it's just not getting anything. <laughs> Wins. Barely. Wins up to Wins. low. Sol take close out that stock. Ah, that stock. Um, solely due to just knocking. There was no edge guard. It was just kind of knocking Falcon. Like she's up to low the against Falcon right now. Yep, that's pretty huge. Um, that's it. I think Catherine's counter picks. She could be in strong. losers finals. She can make the top three. That's kind of nuts. That's that she's might actually in be the money. That might actually be the first time she's made top three. This could have been me. This could have been you. I was on a dumbass. You're on, yeah. <laughs> nice. uh, yeah. That's one thing. One thing Caleb oh, has over Mark is that Caleb's punish on floaties and midweights are just significantly better. Yeah, he's a, definitely he's a grinder. Mm. That was a really good fair, actually. That was. It was it's a basic peach edge guard, but like <laughs> the fact that it happened, I'm like. Oh my god. Oh my god. Do you like that dash tech? Oh, that was really good. It's, oh. A few more percent and Peach would have died. Not letting it back easy. Really? It? Yeah, just. Simple and clean. But again, he's still kind of. Oh, well, he's starting to make it happen now. Yeah, Catherine kind of just. Drifting and floating at like Falcon up air height, and that's not what you want as Peach. up airs. Yep. Mark loves going for um, knee jab into something else. And I mean, you can ASDI a down grab to cover it all, but if, even if you're not comfortable doing that, like you need to be aware that like he's going generally going for one jab into something, so you should be shield grabbing after the jab instead of shield grabbing after the knee and getting hit by jab. Tragic. Getting hit by the umbrella like that. Parasol. Back throw. Back throw. Definitely not what Mark was wanting. You can see him shaking his head in there. You don't think it's some room. new unorthodox mix up? Oh, it doesn't, get, it doesn't get out of that one. It doesn't get the um, head dodge out. Yeah. It'd be a little bit hard to move. This needs. Oh, this. Mark, this, this should be. Yeah, he should be dead. He should be dead. There we go. Right? Should be dead? Yeah. yeah there we go. This, oh, this, this whole set, all three games so far, has been just real, real close. Catherine, like, Catherine's going to side plat when Mark's respawning. And, and double jump cancel? Might be. Maybe. Maybe. <gasps> That's it. Jeez, oh, this is huge. That was such a huge dog. Oh, yeah, good. Doesn't go to... Oh, oh. Ho, 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 no dear. <gasps> oh, my God, oh. what's he doing? Skill. Uh, He's taking so much percent already. Bad DI. Oh, it Jeez. caught the jump. That yeah, they're both just dying at 70. Both falling apart. Oh, the roll, that was definitely not what he wanted. Ooh. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> trying to find his way to center. He's made it. He's taking getting a few hits. Let's. Oh, that was so bad. Oh, not man. only did you not edge guard, oh. but you. But holds down, down smash. Oh, what a player! They're choking so hard. Locks, it holds oh, block, geez. but still gets hit. Oh. oh. Couldn't, couldn't stay uh, close. Catherine, making it to top three. Cap, stay there. Cap, stay there. Got to play against Flow Rats now. That was she, a 3-0 to top three. That's, that's quite something. Mmm. I right, get you to get me to what? Um, change the uh, yeah, stream info. Yeah, yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh boy. There we go. That's easy enough. Well, I'll probably get a one of these buttons does something. Yeah, Cameron's definitely happy about that. She's 
Because they go back and forth. Oh, um, there we go. Between sets. Hello. Hey, there we go. Alright. This is top three. This is uh, losers finals. Which I shouldn't say. You guys are playing for the 30% of the pot. Yeah. How much is that, by the way? <laughs> it's only nine people, so it's not... Nine pesos? Nine pe... No, it's, um... What, 45? I don't know. I believe it's 45, yeah. 45 dollars? Yep. That's quite a lot. <laughs> I don't think it's that much. That's more than I thought <laughs> it would be. Really? Yeah. Nine people? It's five dollar pot. No, no, they're not playing for 45 dollars. They're playing for 30% of the pot. Oh, yeah, yeah. I thought you said third place. No. I thought third place was 45. I'm like, Damn. No, no. I wish third place was <laughs> happy. You know, when I got third place, I got like less than five dollars. <laughs> I got like four four dollars fifty or something. We had like well five or so people that normally show up that just didn't, <laughs> including right. myself. Oh, well. Also, evacs get less people generally than the cheese leagues because uh, Friday nights just aren't as good for a lot of people. People have work and people like and the problem is that. Are they doing Hamels? Team uh, Are they just going in? It looks like Alright, it's going in. No Hamels needed. Nope. Catherine had just played and Jack plays Sheik. You don't need <laughs> Sheik. Hey, <laughs> the C-Stick C -stick works. That's all we need. Now, if Catherine won this set, this would be big. Because I don't think Catherine's ever beaten Jack. And this, like, in power, this is a pretty good matchup for Peach. It's... In NTSC, Sheik has that down throw. Sheik has up air that actually does something other than like combo extensions. Which means you now live with the land of the free. Quite good. <laughs> yeah, we That's what we have. That's what Catherine has to deal with. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, uh, doesn't. Uh, slow get up. Making it a little bit hard for Peach. Uh, like, you want to do get up, else. but you have to be cognizant of what your percent is. Because once you're above 100, you seem to do it a bit earlier. And the problem is, when if you're not quite fast enough, you don't want to go for that down smash. And if you do go for that down smash, you want to accept that they're probably going to wave their shadow shield behind you. Should be, you should be buffering shield. Oh. I, oh, I did update it. Oh, I didn't click the button. There we oh. go. Nice. I thought I had. I swear I clicked the button. Whatever. You had, you had, one, you had, what, you had, you had one job. You had one job, I William. typed it you in. I job. swear I clicked the button. Oh, it's okay. Oh, this needs to be. Oh. That's, that's another one of those oh. situations where it should have probably just should have been it. Jack F tilted her shield and Kafka could have just nared out, but it's plus. It's plus. <laughs> Could you imagine a world where, like, Jack F tilted is, like, plus three on shield? Jesus. I don't want to live in that world. Character would be a bit strong. I mean, like, a lot of characters would still just, like, immediately shield grab, try and eat it, and then ASDI it down. Yeah. But still. I'm just picturing a log where like F tilt grab is. Man, he's like showing grab. He really needs a buffer spot dodge out. <laughs> I guess buffer roll. But anyway, so this, this usually happens between like Jack usually. Oh! Grab him, throw him off, rinse and repeat, try and get as much percent as possible. So do you know why um she like why Jack was in that position where he almost just did? Which position? When he was um when he shot the needles and then he like air dodged like up there. Yeah, he looked like he was air dodging off stage. Yeah. Do you know why? That happens. Was he trying to attack the uh take the down smash? No, essentially um so if you do enough hits in a row, like it's usually only with jabs, but it actually works on needles. Your character actually gets pushed back a little, tiny bit if you do like a certain amount of consecutive hits in a row. Like in a certain frame, so when Sheik shoots like a full charge of needles, um, she'll actually get sent back a tiny little bit. Like just by doing the move. Yeah, just by doing the move. Not like by like she won't like get tossed back um by the animation of throwing them out, but like once they hit on the character, she'll get moved back a tiny bit. That's a that's a big line. Now. I've mm. seen I've seen Jack Riddle. And Catherine's bringing this back. Damn. Dreamland. Well, I mean, wait, this is game one, right? Yeah, yes. it's game one, yeah. So. Dreamland and Smith. Really five. good spot dodge, actually. A lot of time. We had a lot of time in this set to really get your heels in. Yeah, the big moves to avoid right now are grab and bear. Probably bear as well. Oh, that's pretty bad. Oh, 
fourth dimensional, but well. gets punished for it. Yeah. Oh, nice. It's... I didn't see that one coming. That position is so awkward because for Peach, just because she has so many options to cover it, and if she was already grabbing ledge, she could do um, drop down, double jump. Yeah. yeah. Okay, just eats the needle and F-tilts. The old take laser F-tilt bridge. Yeah. Ah, uh, need to... That's just covering roll away. <laughs> nice. Okay. Actually gonna punch designing, yeah. Just retreats the top lad. Oh, Peach really can't do so much. Jack's gonna be off stage. Oh, but this that's is pretty spooky. bad. Yeah. Spooky. Yeah. That reverse was so good! These reverses have been killing his opponents. I've had that happen many, many times in like 2015-16 when you really do need to be just so careful if you're the Peach against Sheik. It's... Alright. Classic. Oh. The classic pull turnip opening. Get Getting beaten open. by first needle. Alright. Keep spot dodging. Yeah, it's... Down for Tetris. It's awkward for Peach because none of you don't have any like really good option off grab against Sheik. No. You maybe oh ooh. no, not a good way to start. That's not. Yeah, like up throw conversions at like 50, 60 uh, sometimes work, but they're not technically Dude. true. She Down tried throw. to tried to wave dash back out of shield, but he, that grab reached all the way. Oh. Not quite. I think now would have hit. But. Yeah, Sheik's shield is quite big, which means nice. at a nice little pullback. <clears throat> On a full shield, um, you're not going to generally get any like shield pokes with area with down smash. Also, right before, um, a little bit before then, uh, Jack started calling out the spot dodge from Catherine and waiting just a little bit, and that's not good for Cath because yeah. <laughs> once those spot dodges start getting called out, also grabbing, holding the turn up is. And if he's got the mental like patience and like. At the, he's in the state of mind to do that. Mm. That's a really good sign for him that he's got the, you know, he's in the he's in the right mindset. Exactly. Playing some melee. Okay, he's got. Captain's got. Oh, this could be so big. Just goes for the nair, catches the di out. Um, well, I like a frame or two. Captain's doing a good job of punishing these pairs. Like Not these like that. Can't let these oh, no. American up there. Huh. I don't know about that that episode there, even though it was max range. And that for said, it could have been oh ho ho beam source. Ah, uh, wait. How's she gonna use this? Probably just gonna throw it, right? Yeah, just chuck it. Yeah, oh. Straight yes. yes. Oh, this one. Nice. For oh, the down smash actually worked out. That was just like the perfect, perfect option. She was. Like, she hadn't touched the ground yet, so it was just timed perfectly to... Ah... Uh, Captain trying to go for a wave dash out of shield grab to punish the down smash, just gets down smashed again. Some non-peach players would call that justice. Yeah. But... But you know better. Yeah, you know. Alright, I think she's probably gonna add ult yet. What percent is the up air gonna kill? It's gonna be... Ooh. Would that have killed? I don't think so, because, like, up would have definitely killed, but Catherine smartly dying away to try and um, only Take give Jack the pair. Yeah. And I think they would have killed. It wouldn't Catherine have killed. I had to go all the way across the stage. Oh! Could be a down tilt, or... Okay. Okay. Resets him. Yeah, she went to gr um, grab ledge, and she was just a bit too close for Peach to, like, get any real... Uh, that float, like, back air, you didn't get the shield grab like that. Should that really be happening? In which scenario, sorry? Well, she she did like a somewhat high like float back air down like into a shield and you just shield grab. If it's really high and you don't pass full, then you can definitely get grabs off it. Oh, Catherine, so she floated out, um, landed then shielded, but then, and like, shielded the fair, but then didn't do anything out of it. And it's just, things looking pretty grim for a... Uh... Oh, Nair's out. Combo break okay. Combo break She needs this now. That's not what you want. I guess it is like it just resets it, but you think down smash whatever might have worked there? Why? 
Why are you? Okay, what DI mix up, baby. DI mix up. Down smash would work if Jack didn't. Um, like, Jack holds down. Yeah. Then he eats yeah, like, the second hit. Yeah, really bad nice. recovery. Which. Not letting it get away with that. It's the theme of this set, I feel. Really poor recoveries. Like, not Catherine, quite covering the recovery as efficiently. It's not quite, as, the mouse not quite as egregious this game, though, as the last game. Because she was already quite behind. Like, that's her. Already down a full These start, last though. couple of sets, they've all been, like, pretty close to the games, but the set count would lead would tell you a different story. 3 0, 3 0. This could be another 3 0, but the games have been pretty close, you know. Yeah, honestly, the past, like, few sets have been quite close. It's, yeah. <laughs> that's a that's a nice word, Nick. <laughs> Cromula. I'm not sure I'm familiar with that word. I'm not big brain enough. That ledge dash up tilt, Jack's been doing that and he's been catching some people out with it. The only person I saw like really deal with it was Kai, but even he got hit by it. It's, I mean it's like Against Jack, I would just be giving him space, yeah. like not not too much space, but just letting him do like his bad ledge option and then covering it afterwards. Oh hey, we got an air! Oh my god, see, it killed. Not grab. Starting to string some things together here. Yep, good di. If you di off, then like Jack was definitely thinking about. Fair, and that's hard. As Peach, you just kind of want to DI. Like, you're going to get hit by. Assuming the Sheik doesn't mess up, you're going to be hit by an Eva, Eva um, up here or up there. So, you just want to DI yeah. to, like, eat the one that. You got to pick, your, pick your poison. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. These dash attacks getting up punished a little bit. Mm. Okay, what's she getting off this? Yeah, that's probably the best choice, to be honest. She was able to, like, quickly grab ledge there. With a the back air out, it was kind of... Couldn't really do it, but... Ooh, sniped. Okay. I think Catherine could have, like, potentially floated around that spot and put out an up air, and would have traded with pretty much everything Jack would have gone for. Ah, uh, okay. So that get up, it works out. Well, not I up. think Catherine was late, but Jack did... I think Jack went for a down smash. Yeah. So... Getting a bit greedy. Yeah. Slightly off play, still beating the greedy play. A bit sloppy. This could be... You know, oh, think. yeah. yeah. So that, I feel like that should not be happening. It's because she's not fast falling. Yeah. She's trying to, like... To be fair, in that spot... You have to put out the bear. You also have to fade into them a little bit to actually get it, and then you want you're trying to fade away to try and avoid the shield grab, and then you also have to fast forward. So there's a lot of like little inputs that yeah. if Catherine loses this game, it's going to be right here, in this spot. But doesn't I was envisioning Catherine overcommitting on the ledge and getting grabbed and then just dying. Yeah, so he kind of kind of um stays out of the immediate ledge option that Jack would have gone for and then goes in once he's already committed. Because once she's in the air off a ledge hop or like even doing a like ledge dash if it's not that great then you can definitely contest it. Just taking his two hit combos. Working his way back into the game but oh. That was good. Oh crap he's grabbed. Last time they both ran up shield and Jack got the um, shield grab. Whereas this time, Catherine just... Oh, she's dead! Wave dashes out. Oh, it's Damn. back. What a Damn. needle. Damn, I might be wrong. 7%? Oh. Oh, that's... Gonna be a bit... Of, it's gonna hurt, okay, well, he's not going quite for. dead. Oh. Okay. I don't think... I don't think F-Tilt's the best choice. At low percent. Wait a minute. You can down for it. Wait a minute. Needed a down smash. Really needed a down smash. I would have probably back there. Yeah. Peach is not fast enough to get 
get in place to really try and punish you for it, but... So, <laughs> Catherine, was, she was just smashing the A button. She just wanted, didn't care how many, um... Didn't care how she got it, she just wanted the win. She just wanted that in there. Um, if Jack was a bit cleaner, he definitely could have opened her up quite, like, quite a bit. Because if he just... Then that just, up tilt just a little calm, bit faster. Right? Just gotta stay calm, stay collected. Alright, one stadium. This is. I feel like it's probably either this or Yoshi's as the Sheik counter picks. Also, another punish on the. The thing is, Catherine's um, spot dodge got punished, but Jack didn't really get much off it. He got grabbed, down throw into F2, and. If the punish is only a little bit, it's still, it's still maybe worth it going for it, right? Mm. Before you get out of it, it's really. These platforms are actually messing up Jack's. Down for punishes, but he gets the grab on top of the platform, so that kind of just kind of messed up now. Yep. Oh, ooh, that was really good, and he's got, like, Kevin getting so much off this, because, well, would have. Would have. She punished the roll. They still got quite a bit. Damn, wow. Is that four? I, yeah, I was playing with power. I'm pretty sure that's because Kevin was late. Like, I'm pretty sure in that spot you get the arm. Yeah, Kevin. I don't know if she wanted that, because if she was watching another Peach play, oh. did the Nair jab? Nair jab, yeah. And she said he probably didn't want that. I wonder if she was like, she's trying to throw me off. She like, keep that secret Peach tech to herself. Like, oh, like, but closes it out. This is Oh, this is... Yep. You just, like, you just want to DI in that spot, because you'd rather get up it at worst than... Or even in there, than get something like battle stage. Even at low percent, you can still potentially get him. She crosses him up, but then doesn't do a down smash. Damn. Jack respecting the back air that time, even to the point that she whiffed a jab in front of him. <laughs> they're both slugging. They're both just kind of putting out hitboxes near each other. Just trying to, just trying to get that little, little something. Like, a lot of time Jack's going for, especially when he's near, near the edge of the stage, he's going for... Um, Short hop or more, more often full hop needles, and then mixing up whether he immediately shields, expecting Catherine's dash tag, or he does a dash tag of his own to punish Catherine's, say, turn up pull dash away. Throws that turn up right over his head and just gets whacked. Like, avoiding the grounded needles. Avoiding the that, grounded that's, needles. That's big in SA, apparently. <laughs> that's the new. Uh, the new Twitch streamer. The, yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Really bad now. Well, not bad. Ah, uh, bad. Right. Uh, needs. Yep. And now, uh, um, I was gonna say forward throw off a grab, but that's so big. Oh my god, that was huge damage off Just the back air barely clipping into the down smash. Got him kind of in the corner, but... Like, really clean aerial before into a dash away, but then just kind of gets grabbed anyway by Jack the next time she goes in. All right. Now on this transformation... Oh, I'm, I would not be going in here. Yeah, I'd she's just be... going in. Maybe she can pull ten from down there. Yeah, just... Uh, Jack can steal one, maybe try and get in there. I wouldn't be going in if I was... Going. Don't oh, just contest cap. <laughs> Why? Oh! She's the top. Why? Yeah, I think Sheik's got uh, the upper edge. Why would you? The crowd's certainly showing its bias. Ah, uh, she's done that punish up the air dodge. It would have been so big, but. Oh, the Nair, that's it. That's yeah, it. last stop. Stock of game four. Okay. That's yeah, that down throw when you dare away, it's gonna be kinda of hard for her to peach to get down there and really get some sort of follow up. I think. Oh, this is a really big lead Jack's gotten though. But if uh, Catherine had the down smash but didn't expect Jack to tech in, so she's kinda of uh, pulled a turn up. Good reactions by Jack. I think she's in she did an okay spot. She can go high. But yeah, Jack ready for it. Catherine's been air dodging. Oh, that's... Oh, clips! She's back. Bear. Got another chance. She really needs to bleed bear at the moment. But... Oh, if that Nair had just not reversed, it would have been huge. 
This is still Big totally money. doable. A good, I like, fully died now. Very doable, but oh, this, is, this should be it, right? Yeah. Keeps it clutch. 3-1. Oh, still very good by Catherine making top three. Making top In three. The money. Yeah, that's a good showing. And when Grant? Yeah, no, it's Grand Finals. Grand Final Florets versus Kaiser. Sheik versus Frelker. <laughs> All right. Um, anything could happen. Anything. Anything could happen. If you just believe, there's no earthly way of knowing <laughs> which direction we are going. Is it <laughs> raining? <laughs> Is <laughs> it snowing? Is a hurricane <laughs> blowing? Please stop. There's a speck of light <laughs> showing. <laughs> I was trying to think of a way to like bring it into melee somehow. I was thinking, well, like, is that like a laser or like a... Sh I, I don't know. I, just, I, I had like an idea, but then I didn't want to commit to it. The creepy smile just makes it all the more worse. Peepy smile? No, the creepy. Oh, the creepy the smile. Creepy. But the people couldn't see my smile. No, but to me. <laughs> What's creepy about my smile? Oh, well, you're <laughs> the way you just looked. You definitely were trying to... Is it raining? Oops. He's trying to rock the The couch. danger must be growing, for the rowers keep on rowing without any sign that they are slowing. Anyway, grand finals. <laughs> Back to the match. And in case you didn't know, Flores is in losers. He's ah, going to yes. have to take two sets, not just the one, if he wants to take home the grand prize. Hmm? Yep. Grand finals, set one. Strap yourself in. It's... Possibly gonna be a banger. We have no idea. Right, we're, we're both um, we're still doing hamelmas. Yeah, doing drinks and things and preparing. The grand prize. And what if they win the grand prize? What are they taking home tonight? Damn! What are they? T are they are taking this brand home brand new Honda <laughs> Civic Toyota Focus? They are Focus. taking home twenty-seven dollars. <laughs> Twenty-seven dollars. You that know how many Zinger boxes you can buy with that? Dude, after um, more than two. If you take out entry fee, that can buy you two Zambi burritos. Damn. Or yeah. the new, or the new uh, dunks Zinger burger TM KFC. Try now, only X money. Less ha about about half the prize winnings minus the entry fee. <laughs> Mentor C fresh. Man. Now cheese leaks are definitely where the money's at. Cheese leaks. <laughs> what kind of cheeses can you purchase for that amount of money? Probably some like, you know, something pretty nice, right? By where's the money at? I mean that, you know. Well, Sixteen to eighteen entrance. Twenty two. Twenty large maybe twenty. Twenty two, yeah. Slow yeah. down there, champ. Well, Flores is going to have to win the, win the tournament first before he goes hog wild. It's true. He hasn't Kai's, won yet. Kai's he here to stop him. <laughs> he it seems like an in inevitability, but, you know, Jack hasn't actually won this tournament yet. He Not the laser forward smash by Kai. He's been making them work this tournament. He's, He's back been on busting it out. He's back on net play. He's back Maybe. on his... Probably not. On his bull grind. <laughs> Slap him. Oh, no, not the bear. Rejection. Rejection! <laughs> <laughs> I love how Falco hits the first air, has like. Has, got, a, has, has an internal, you just think, man, should I go for Yane? I don't know. Maybe I should taunt. Seems like the right idea. Yeah, yeah. let's go for Yane. That's a nice hit confirm. Uh, yeah. Ooh, really yeah, good anti air up to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but just finished, baby. It's gonna have put put a bit of fear in Kai. He's gonna have to think about that option next time. Oh, gets hit. Is that the needle messing him up there? I believe so. Coming in big, coming in the clutch, saving Florets. Yeah. Made it again. <laughs> oh no. He's really gotta stop falling for that bait. He really does. 
It's costing them big time. Like, I can see he why wants he to get that big cheese money. <laughs> yeah. Trying to make it work here. Like, that fair almost could have worked. The like reverse fair. He's just imagine a world where Jack does an immediate like slight dash, shield stop, then hits, then jumps out of shield and reverse fares for oh, the the micro space. Walking home with 22 frozen cokes and that one. Yep. Oh, the... oh. <laughs> Jack running up and turning around, kind of just like stuttering a little bit. Yeah. And then... Jack, oh. definitely, I think he's just trying to shield grab in places where it's really, it's not, it's not going to work out. It's gonna, uh, slips under it. The player. Yeah, the um. Sweet spot for spacey up B is actually really broken if you're above a giant. You grab so far away. Pretty good. It's pretty yeah. good. Some people might have you believe that Farco's recovery is bad, but I think it's above average. Honestly. I think, I think back to the days of 2010 when Cox was a glass cannon. Yeah. I mean, he is when he gets hit, but. Yeah, when Farco gets hit, it's pretty bad. Farco gets like, hit. I think when you compare to all the characters in melee, his, his recovery is pretty good. Mm. He does have a lot of options. Yeah. <laughs> Again. Oh, look. Jack was already pretty far behind. Jack, maybe he's conditioning him, right? Maybe he's <laughs> maybe. conditioning him. And maybe. then set two your grand finals. <laughs> set two game ten. We're he's, gonna He's we're gonna not gonna do it, and then mm. I don't know. We're gonna see the He's the still way. not gonna get he's gonna wave dash out and grab up to the down smash, I guess. No, picture this. We're, to, we're game three, that is up to O. Last dot game three. Jack shields this time. Doesn't shield grab. Doesn't get doesn't shield grab. Gets the back throw. Loses game four, but he's gonna be like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, loses game four when he does it again. <laughs> <laughs> Goes back. <laughs> he's like, yep, punished yeah. it once. Yeah, he's now not going to do it again. <laughs> he's going to do it again. <laughs> oh, my God. I lost to this guy. He just did it. What a scrub. Look, we all have, we all have bad habits that we... we I can laugh, but there's definitely bad habits of mine that just get punished over and over again. Nice by Kai. When he took the needles, he barely lost any height on the upbeat. He was so ready to just quickly... Oh, <laughs> that was a bit odd. That somehow almost worked. Down through, it was going to get broken. There we go. <laughs> Ground the needles into dash grab. <laughs> it just, it works. Yeah. I don't know I mean, why. It, is it, it's frame it advantage, right? Isn't it? No. <laughs> no? I didn't think so. Mental advantage. No, no, it, it, is, it is. I believe it is. Either like frame advantage on uh, neutral if you like land with it, but not if you do ground it. <laughs> the mental advantage. The mental advantage. You're like man, I got hit. I got 17%. Yeah. It's like oh, so she was she was in, on the ground. How is she supposed to do needles? It's not supposed to work. 40 more percent. I can't start. I can't start holding down against she. What's you know what? Oh, oh Jack mixing up the aerial needles. This guy is evolving before our very eyes. That was actually really good. Yeah, that was actually so good. Yes, those are the kind of oh. those are the kind of moments where Falco suddenly starts to become a lot less oppressive, mm. and he starts to really, you know, some of his weaknesses shine through, and he gets a few hits and he can die. When you make Falco second guess whether he should blaze or not, that's when it starts. It's pretty strong. Sure. What was that DI? Really good bear. Honestly. I think he was he was trying to fade back, right? Yeah. And then he got the bad DI. Just didn't expect um. All right, we got the we got the beat. The beat coming out. Yeah. Did expect Chloris to twice already. He's on three to one on the stage. He's been doing really well on FOD. It feels like. Maybe that's yeah. just me. I mean, that was the game he won against um winners finals. Yeah, against Kaimans. This is a rematch of winners finals. Yeah. So, oh, nice. Kai, like, once again, a nice repeat of winners finals. Kai. Ready to drop the ledge and back at at any moment. That was like stringing it together. Jack was definitely a it's time to cook. Later. It's going to work. I uh, should have. I think he should have added. Then again, Falcon probably doesn't. Was, was he trying to read the double jump out of his stun there? Maybe that would have been hella sick. That, that probably yeah. might have killed. At least, at least been a huge 
advantage. <laughs> oh, that's real. Okay, gets out. Only takes 15%, but that was such an awkward position. So. What a great up air punishing that, uh, punishing the shine. That was, out really there. that was a really good, um, fair actually by Jack. It was yeah. tricked him with the DI mix up. I think Kai was dying to expect, um, up air. And All right. One to one. One to one, set one. There can only be one. Huh? First place, number one. Okay, good match. Oh, oh. A lot of respect there being shown these shields. Yeah, I think Jack Jack really doesn't want to get a grab in that spot. He like it, him personally doesn't want to go for the grab in that spot. He um he's trying to bait out a jump by Kai and punishing it. Ooh, really good. And that was one of the big things that um, Jack was missing last set. He was just dropping what, some of the more free edge guards. And so you reckon if he can ooh, let the eye, maybe if he's a little bit, in, maybe a bit of smash the eye, he can live there. Maybe. So you think if Jack just cleans up his edge guards, he's actually potentially favored to win this? <laughs> I wouldn't go that far, but it would be key. It would be a lot closer. Not a lazy forward smash. Hang on him up. How many times is this? How many times has he hit that? It's been like it's getting close to double digits. I bet. Dash dance to roll behind your opponent. That, yeah. <laughs> Straight up. Yeah. That was. Yeah. Jack hitting these edge guards are keeping him in. He's Kai taking the moment to think on the platform. <laughs> so many players. That's either. not what you want to do. Is she like just giving up the stage? Well, what he, he he went he gave up stage and he jumped, then he double jumped, yeah. and he was so he basically put himself at the very edge of the stage without like against a potentially still slightly invincible Falco. Kai's like, Kai still going for the uh, shine like on like high high shine on the shield, double jump up mm. away. Mm -hmm. uh, even though there's no platforms on this stage, it's kind of interesting that he do that. I yeah, wonder why. You'd think he you'd think on you wouldn't do it on FD. Might be habit, possibly. Muscle memory. Or well, maybe he's thinking he can come down with a laser and uh, still make it work. Mm. I think there might have been a world where Sheik lives that with like a specific DI to like. Just gets hit. Like some sort of up and away. Alright, we're gonna see down for it? Alright. Oh, how did that hit? That really shouldn't have worked. No, but... I did the right thing on the jab. He held like. He held down and shielded, and he just... See that? He double jumped away again, but this time he gets away with it. Mm. Oh this is a really crucial game. Yeah, he and doesn't want to get throw it back through in right now. Mm. Edge. I think... I definitely think Jack should have edged this. Should be dead, right? Okay. There's not much he can do here. Jack. Oh, he had his jump. He just burnt it and he got eaten by the laser. Right. Kai up 2 1. And he is, of course, in winner's side. So he really needs the one more to one seal more? it away. Yep. Seal it away and claim that big, big, big cheese money. <laughs> I mean, is this? I mean, this is technically not big cheese, but this is. This you, is know, you, know, you, know, you know, our monthlies are like. Well, they're the cheese league, right? Uh, cheese, league, yeah. yeah. Not this is. This is. Uh, this isn't in the cheese league either. This is like a weekly thing, right? Yeah. Well, it's our it's e fortnightly something evac thing. Yeah. Technically, it's unaffiliated with the big cheese. But no, could be getting that sweet, sweet evac tournament money. Yeah. So just forget I said anything. Otherwise, ooh. otherwise Jack's gonna come in with the. With the licensing fees or whatever, the copyright. Damn. And claim. Kai looking pretty strong in this game. First that opening stock, and then working his way in, taking take another. Oh, okay. Still not dead, but that's gonna be it. There was no DI there. That was really not what he wanted. 
Yeah, I wonder if that was like actually true or whether she could have shielded. Obviously, Jack wasn't expecting it, so it was a really good play. Man, that needle almost really good hit. Catching his dash. All right, that's going to be it. That was pretty big. I can't let Kai run away with a third like that. <laughs> oh, that STR on the needles. He's out of there. I ain't getting grabbed out of the needles this time. Get me out of here. Do you think you could SDI the needles in and try and punish? <laughs> you know what? If you were good. Maybe. That would actually be like hard SDI in. Another laser bear smash. Add him, add him to the book. Yeah. Damn. Is this really how it's going to end? Out of these close games, Kai's just sort of found his rhythm. Maybe he's figured him out. Oh, okay. Not ready for that. Yeah, it's a big thing. Jack really just needs to um, work on arms attacking that. Runs into shine. Okay, this. Whoops him. Oh, this. Ooh. No hitbox in the firebox. Oh, no. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Jack's not good. Oh, that was. Kai takes it. You know? Ah, oh, no. The mental composure not quite there. Not quite. Oh. He's done it. He's defended his winner's bracket victory in uh, another set. And, you know, those games are pretty close, but the final game, pretty convincing. Convincing stuff. Yeah. Cemented himself as the best player currently in the building, clearly. <laughs> Although, I, I mean, what else, would, what else? Nothing else would make sense. Look. Look, ca catch, me at, catch me at Cheese League. No, Kai might oh, actually yeah. be there. If, in a world of our Ruben, like, well, it's like it's an interesting dynamic right now, right? Where um, I'm heavily favored against. Huh? Swap seats? What did he say? I can't hear. Oh, all right, swap screens. Uh, we go. Hey. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, and I, um, it's the end of the tournament. Like Ruben, Ruben's favored against Kai. Kai's favored against me. Um, I'm favored against Ruben. Is he really? Is Kai favored well, against you? Slightly favored, I'd say. I'd say I. Damn. I'd say um, probably. Damn. I think subscription for four months, three hours ago. Pog champ. No, we definitely go back and forth, but he's won the last one or two. <gasps> there we go. Whoa! The technology—it's the it's production value. Pay sure no mind to that other thing. Uh, yeah, this one. There we go. Whoa! I figured it out. All right, we get to see this get lovely see. venue. Yeah, you get to see, come come down, say hi. Uh, yep, you're always well. All new players always welcome. They sure are. If there are any out there, I believe that's some brawl being played just behind us. <laughs> yeah, if you're into that, you can't quite make it out on the on this on the stream. No, that's that definitely that's definitely PM. You sure? Okay, yeah, it's it definitely was playing. PM. It was playing. I think it was playing brawl earlier. Or at least Catherine said it was. Might be. Either way, he did say he was going to Project Plus for Cheese League, so yep. there you go. We have some Smash yeah. Ultimate to the I left of us. I, I might end up entering like four or five games at Cheese League, at I'm the Big Cheese. I'm entering um, Project Plus. going to go 0-2 in like four of them. Oh, yeah. I mean, you do love entering the SVC. Yeah. Playing some playing some games. I think I'm going to play Melee, Unist, Marvel, Tekken, and possibly Third Strike. And is there anywhere I've, I think I've forgotten? I don't think so. Good for you. Yeah. My new new device. I don't know. Probably not going to do that well, but, you know. Really. I, I'm right. not expecting any, any any victories, really, but, you know, well, it's always fun. Well, that's pretty much everything summed up, I'd say. Yeah, it's, that's it. That's, you know, not much else to... Congratulations to Kai for... For his first place victory. I'm sure he'll... Oh, no. Oh! Oh! If you still hear us, I'm sure he'll celebrate nicely with a beautiful frozen Coke. All right, well, courtesy of our sponsors. <laughs> Hello to all our nine viewers currently. We're going yeah, to... Who wants to talk with me? Yeah, sure. Right. Hey. Hey. Well done. Kept composure. Crap kept tournament. <laughs> <laughs> Crap well, tournament. that's what happens when... It, that is what happens. That's that is what, what happens. That's what oh, well. I'm just the best... I'm just... The gatekeeper. The gatekeeper. The gatekeeper. <laughs> Actual Kaiser doesn't come out until he's played four days at a major. That's just how no, it is. That's just how it is. 
I only played okay when I played Will D at the start of the at the start mm -hmm. of the tournament. That was my first time playing melee since last night. Damn. Well, like last night is just me switching up the control for ten minutes, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but before that, it was like a while. Anyway. Hopefully, you'll be in better form for the upcoming Cheese League. That's not that, that's not this Sunday. No. It yeah, it's the one after. It's one after. It's yeah. my birthday this Sunday, actually. Fuck. Whoa, happy Dude, birthday! Dude, it actually in crept up on me. It actually crept up on me because I was like, "Holy fuck, I might want to go to Port Pirie." Yeah, yeah. Like so <laughs> I made that decision. So I'm gonna be away for a couple of days. So that'll be good. I'm gonna, be be fun. I'm gonna be 25. Damn. Fuck. It's <laughs> creepy. Oh, yeah, 2014 <laughs> seemed. Yeah, yeah. Like 2014 was so far away. Yeah. And when I was just a young little 20 year old mm -hmm. starting mm -hmm. uni. And then Ali was like, oh, yeah, we need commos for commentators for Avcon. So I'm like, all right, let's go to JB Hi Fi and get a $50 cash card. And then yeah. that's how it all starts, man. That'll, yeah. That's literally how it all starts. Thank you, Wilco Tom, for fo uh, following. Some. Um, yeah, like, I don't know. Jack seemed pretty upset about everything that was going on, but um, <laughs> oh, be, I, I, mean, <laughs> I mean, to be fair, how how many? I mean, that Jack, ending was crap. That, yeah, that ending was crap. But um, I think Jack, you know, generally needs a um, little also, bit of cool down. Also, he um, every time I did that nair on his shield on the oh, yeah, back, yeah, yeah, he was like, yeah, I was trying to fucking nair out of shield. I'm like, yeah, but I was yeah, also yeah, spacing yeah, for yeah. both anyway. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, and he's like, yeah, but I could drift back. I'm like. Well, to be fair, you no, not real. I mean, you didn't yeah. like when he was on the ledge. What's he fading back to? Yeah, yeah, like exactly. Yeah, like he's like going to the ledge, and I'm like, I'm gonna steal that by that time. And I mean, Jack's ledge options aren't that great. Real, I mean, Sheik doesn't have the most, but he can stall, which is pretty hype. Yep, I like a stall. Oh. I fucking love a stall, man. I love a stall. Like, just just do it a few times, because yeah. that. You know, why I always just do the upbeats at the ledge because, and like, I always get hit by it. Because of it, it's just because I'm like, well, if I'm like perfect on this every time, yeah, they yeah. can't touch me. They can't, yeah. But but that never happens, and I always like fuck up the up piece somehow. Mm. So that's why I just do it over and over and over again. Every time I do things in tournament, it's with the intention of like uh, practice, essentially. Sure. That's why it's like you see me do weird things sometimes, and like the wrong things come out pretty often. Especially now with my C stick, it gets like side aerials instead of down aerials a lot now. Oh no, yeah. It's pretty upsetting. That's I do this like sweet back air, and I'm like, oh, they're off stage. Time for a down air, and I just fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm dead, but you know. Um, oh. how you been? Not have bad. You, not have <laughs> you, did you play any friendlies today? I played like four or five. I played a few against, like two against McLeod because he wanted some warm up before yeah. playing Will. Yeah. Uh, he wanted like some peach dittos. Um, <laughs> I got in at, like. These actually gotten better though. Yes, it's good to see. I'm really happy that like some of our lower tier players are. On we, the come up, well, you know why? Because we got a stream. <laughs> oh, it honestly like being able to see your being able to see your like vods and is really really helpful for improvement. And honestly, sometimes just from an ego point of view, <laughs> sometimes you know you have a good tournament. It's nice just to look back on the vods and look back on commentary. And literally, like, when I get home from uh, either a cheese league or a um, oops, uh, um, literally as soon as I get home from a tournament. I like load up the stream on my big TV and I just sit in front of it for ages and mm. I'm just like, I'll get all the feelings out now while mm -hmm. it's fresh in my mind. Yep. And then when I come back to it, I'm like actually looking at stuff. Sure. Well, I mean, I look at both, but you know. Mm -hmm. What about you? When you watch a game bag, what are you like thinking about? You just like, oh, oh I'm so shit, because that's <laughs> what how I feel a lot of the time. I always, well, I look for like the certain key like situations and interactions that like I botch something and then um, try and think what should I have done like a example I suppose is like when I'm say against you right when I'm looking at say certain recoveries that I mess up like mm. punishing I think to myself what should I have done and then I like the answer is always grind. dash attack <laughs> and um, <laughs> the always dash attack like sometimes it's like should I have like dropped down a little bit more should I have like you're pretty, back a little bit you're pretty good on that. I guess that's why you've picked it up so well. Um, oh. Because you were definitely dropping heaps of edge guards earlier in the year. And then yeah. now, like, if I do a feedback, you just shine me instantly. Yeah. Um, See, that's the VODs in action. The VODs, yeah. The VODs the in VOD, action are VODs. fucking real, but nobody wants to, like... It's not that I'm, like, a hey, nobody ever give me the respect, but, like, streams make a big deal to scenes. They really? Yeah. Um... And that's why I've always cared about the stream a lot. It's because, mm -hmm. like, whenever people would be like, oh, like, like, I see a new people person walk in, 
I'm like, oh yeah, how'd, like, how'd you find out about it? And they're like, oh, yeah, we watch the stream all the time. I'm yeah. like, oh, beautiful. Because like, I have so many of those conversations and it warms my heart every time because yeah. I'm just like, fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> Knowing that you're like making a difference to the scene. Oh, thank oh, you. Big money. GGs. Wait. Oh. 27. Seven. Yep. 27. 27, yeah. That's a Simpsons reference for everyone <laughs> playing at home. Um, Yeah, like, see, it, it literally all started because of uh, VGBC. Because mm -hmm. I was like, oh, yeah. I can see how, like, people start to, like, you know, take it a bit more seriously. Mm -hmm. And, like, when you would watch the old Xanadu VODs, you would see, like, the same people week to week. And you would, like, see the improvement. And you would see rivalries. And you'd see, like, things change. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the most important thing that a stream can provide is, like, how things change over time. Yeah. Because, like... What's the point of a scene if it's just going to be the same the whole time? I know. Could you imagine a That's scene where, like, the same people... Like, we were talking about it. Hey, yeah. we were talking about it back on the friendly setups, but, like, man. Uh, <laughs> Streaky era. Oh, yeah. That was five years ago now, and, like, fuck. Glad we got out of that. Yep. Glad we got out of that. It was a good time, though. I think, to be fair, it... Like, honestly, it was... not helpful during that time when there was less events going on oh god like, yeah, right like we we would have like one tournament every month maybe like maybe and then we did the evac tournaments and then the rest was yeah. history i know Fuck yeah. Um, i always reminisce about the old days the, yeah, the <laughs> old <two. laughs> literally always because i got all the vods and shit so hmm. i'm like oh yeah let's have a trip down memory lane or yep. something like that i'm like ah oh, look at these pm vods that's so good remember ollie as, 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 ollie as a person was, ollie was yep. so hyped such a hype addition to the scene. Mm -hmm. Just loved, loved being at events with him. Matt. Man. Uh, some great friendlies were played in the formative years of us. <laughs> yeah. I have to say, some great friendlies were played in the formative years. To the friendly streams? <laughs> that was the thing when, like, you had more, like... Not that I had more drive then, but it was more like... We like, had less on? You yeah, we like had less had on. Less, like, yeah. We had much less on, and I also and wasn't bringing a whole computer to hmm. events. So I was like, yeah, I'll just do this. Because, you know, that was like the thing back then. Yeah. Was doing those like fighting game TV streams. Hmm. If you if you, if you you remember, like, if you wanted to get better at Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3, you'd tune in to FG TV and there'd just be like pro players playing on that all the time. Like Filipino champ, Justin Wong, whoever. Yeah, that's that's muskets. Huh. You got the nunchuck stick. I sure Disgusting. do. I, oh. I, um, no, I really like using it. I like you like the You like the height? Yeah, also just the, um, it's loose, but it's not too loose. Okay. That's, I really appreciate that. I think it, it would probably be better for you, like, for grip and shit like that, but, you know. Mm. Oh. Um, but, yeah, I think, um, I think we're done. Yeah, I think so. It's I think we're going to, we're, we're going to sign off, host Nez, say hi to him, tell him to sponsor me with a controller. <laughs> That'd be pretty sick. All right. We, we're done. Yep. We're done. We're going right. to. See you guys. Peace out. And, uh, follow my Twitter. We stream these events every two weeks on Fridays, so mm -hmm. definitely follow that and SA Smash Central on on Twitter. And also, don't forget, we got Big Cheese big coming cheese, up. Yeah, December seven and eighth. Go to smash.gg/bigcheese too mm -hmm. and sign up for the big event at the. We've end already of got year. a decent amount of entrants. Like we quite have fifty five, and like last year we had like seventy seven total. Considering this is what we've only had like three or four days of red. Yeah, day. yeah. I'm really, I'm really happy about that. Like, whoa, cool that people want to come. Mm. That's what I'm, uh, that's what I'm about. But anyway, we, right. we done. Anyway, let's peace. Catch you guys. Peace out, everyone. It's been real.